What's this? Lemon actually on time for once? No. No, never happen. Uh-uh. <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Wherever you are, whatever you're doing, hope you're doing well. Goodness gracious, let's go. So, for those of you with eyeballs, um, you'll notice that I already have the Blades of Mercy. I decided to go ahead, make sure this is recording as well. I decided to go ahead and get the Blaze of Mercy early, uh, simply because uh, it's a hell of a grind. Good lord. Uh, it is a hell of a grind to get this thing. Now, it will be in the video, right? Like, what I did to get these will be in the video. For those of you that aren't aware, basically what you do is you run all the way to Eileen, you slap her on the back and say, hey, a hunter must hunt, and then she gets mad at you and chases you. You drop her off a ledge. Uh, she tries to climb up a ladder, you do a thing, and she dies. Uh, after that, you uh, can grab the badge from her, and then you can go buy the Blades of Mercy for 40,000 souls, which is a little bit much uh, in the early game. And so that's what I was doing for about three hours this week, just kind of uh, getting the Blades of Mercy. So... Uh, that didn't seem like it would be a fun stream, so I made sure to get that all ahead of time. But here we are. We've got our blades. Everything is doing good. Let's get this party started. I have not killed any bosses. I've not done anything. I think I grabbed a couple of the items while I was around, like just some of the early... What do you want to call them? Upgrade materials. Um... But outside of that, that's all I've done. So. Let's see. Solaris, is it still a little low? Or is that just on your end? I guess that is a big question. Uh, I'm not used to streaming with my PS4. So, uh, is the volume too low? Too high? What's going on? Somebody let me know. Alright. How'd I get him early? I told you just a minute ago. <laughs> Ludwig! A hunter must hunt. Very true. All right, let's see what we're dealing with here. Hmm. Okay. So, very quick attacks. I like that. Damage could use a little work. And we don't have... We're not using a pistol, so I can't rely on that. I do know that if you dodge and then attack, it increases the damage a little bit. Whoa. Uh, so we can probably rely on that to help us out. Yeah, significant damage boost there, actually. How's the strong attacks? Oh, they get the job done. Okay, okay. You missed the horn? No, you don't. <laughs> no, you don't. You think you do, but you don't. Ooh, still alive. Okay. Just kind of getting used to him. Feeling him out. It's been a hot minute. It's been a hot minute since I played some Bloodborne. Steel Striker! So what is the stigma around these blades? I don't think there's really a stigma. I think just some people don't use them. Um, I love having daggers in my Soulsborns. So I guess I've never really used them. I've never really used them, so I guess that's the stigma. Alright. So let's see here. We need to go basically right to gas coin. I guess there's a couple things we could grab, like the brooch. Oh, I appear to have already gotten the tinkering box. Good. Okay. Oh, I guess we could also go after the cleric beast. That's, that'd be a fun test. Yeah. Yeah, fun fact, I am not very good at Bloodborne. <laughs> I am quite bad at Bloodborne. Um, so this might be more of a test of my own skills. Oh, Jesus Christ. Than anything else. I tend to get either too aggressive or not enough. 
Just because I have too much Bloodborne or too much Dark Souls training. Too much Dark Souls training. I don't. It's hard to break the habit. Let's see here. Cobalt. Why do they call it a blade of mercy when you blades in the food? Out. He. What? Oh God. <laughs> Uh, Cobalt, I need you to go to sleep. Um, <laughs> you're running out of fumes over there, buddy. Alright. Thanks for your donation, though. Appreciate it. Ooh, no. No, I said. I said no. <laughs> Alright. Let's go straight to the Cleric Beast, huh? Let's just go right for the good stuff. Get this party rolling. Is the plan to keep them physical or go arcane? No idea. Um, I have a feeling that the current ones I have aren't really built to have arcane gems. So chances are we'll probably go physical for most of it. Oh, God. Okay. All right. Starting off strong. Thank you, Cleric Beast. Mm. All right. Let's, uh, let's go anywhere but here. That damage makes me sad. I am stuck on a thing. Okay. There we go. Again with the smacking. Again with the yelling and the smacking. Oh, God. Now, these weapons do not appear to be very good at regaining health uh, or causing wound damage. So that's not good. So that's not good. We, those are kind of a big part of Bloodborne, and we're not going to get to use them. Use them well, anyway. Maybe I just need to do some stronger attacks. Maybe that's what the deal is. Ow, Jesus Christ. Yeah, first, first boss in Bloodborne is the camera, for sure. Yeah, I think that's probably why I struggle in this game so much, is that literally every boss is a camera fight. God, I'm just eating my... Eating my blood vials. Ow, dude. Freaking quit, man. There's a wound, finally. Jesus. 30% through your health bar, and I finally break something. There we go. Okay, there we go. Catboy, appreciate you. Glad you're enjoying it. Saw a couple other things in there, but I'm a little concentrated. Have to give me a minute. Oh, Christ, come on, man. <laughs> uh. So yeah, remember when I said I was bad at Bloodborne? <laughs> this is what it looks like. So for me, everyone else is like, oh, this isn't a challenger, and I'm like, guys, this is it's gonna be hard as hell. I don't <laughs> How do you any how does anyone play this game? Maybe if we, maybe if we do the old don't lock on ability, maybe that'll help. Nope, not really. I'm still swinging behind him. Stamina regen there. There we go. Ow. Stop with the hitting. <laughs> I know it's me. I know it's not the game. I know it's me because Dan, who has never beaten, well, well, now he has, but who had originally never beaten a single Dark Souls game in his life, uh, and was like, just kind of like, I like these games, but I don't, I'm not good at them. I don't like them that much. He beat Bloodborne in like three days. He beat it in three days. First tried most of the bosses. He's like, yeah, this is a great game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, what? How? How did you first try the Orphan of Cause? I don't understand. What are you doing over there? Oh, God. So, it's, it's definitely a me thing. It's definitely... It's definitely just me not knowing what to do. Not knowing. I'm, it's the... I think it's the difference in speed. Like, it's just... So many of these attacks are just like, yep, smacked. 
And I'm over here just not knowing what to do. Alright, we almost got him, though. Enough with this random smacking with that hand. Good God, man. What I would do... To oh, Jesus. Okay, well, thank you, camera. Cool. Good ending. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Oh, uh, well. A fine start. You forgot how much the clarity screams? You, you, you get ready. You forgot how much everything screams. Oh, boy. Yep, that was... Hmm. Okay. Why am I back here? Oh, right, right, right. Because I have a, a thing now. That was the first boss of fight. Okay. Yes. Give me those that I will never use. Thank you. Give me this. I'll never use that. Thank you. I have a single health pot because that's a thing in this game. Uh, let's see. We need screaming horn. We do not need either of those things. <laughs> Where's the boss music gone? Because I have to record this, I can't have the boss music gone because that would interfere with all the music that I put in the videos. So we can't do it that way. Can't do it that way. What was my first build in Bloodborne? Uh, weirdly, I went with a Kirk hammer, uh, which was a mistake. Um, <laughs> was a really rough time. My first playthrough in this game was a really rough time. Um, I struggled on every boss. It had just the worst luck. Uh, the second time through, what did I use? I think I was using the Holy Sword the Ludwig's Holy Sword. I think that was better. I think that one worked better for me. Never really used like the saw cleaver or the whip or anything like that. Those just, those just never came to me for some reason. But yeah, I don't know. I've, uh, I've never really had a good time in this game. Oh no, actually I take that back. Uh, one of the, the, uh, dex weapon. What is that thing? The katana that you can stab yourself with and then do it does like lead damage the entire time that one that one I had a good run with that one worked out for me but uh, before that though the Chicago yeah that's the one um, yeah that one was a good time for some reason that one worked really well and I don't know why um, but outside of that though yeah I was I was struggle busting pretty hard All right, so we can see. Is this just going to be a dodge R1 run? Is that is that? That's all I gotta do. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, we don't have to both. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Uh, so chat, how is this weapon good without? a pistol because uh, <laughs> it's pretty bad this weapon is pretty bad I don't understand you need more bullets that's uh, we can't uh, we can't use the bullets bullets are not a blade of mercy are they what if I what's hold on maybe maybe we need to use the short sword version of this weapon maybe that's the thing Oh god, wait, no. Is that the same band? That the Oh, that's the same amount of damage. Oh wow, okay, no. Beast pellets? Well, maybe, but that's not until later, man. Sneak up and heavy. Yeah, we could try that. Of course if he's already looking at us, that doesn't really help us now, does it? But actually I think this. Oh, you can't, you can't sneak attack or heavy attack like that. It's gotta be the short sword version. I think this game has one of the faster R1s. Or faster. Okay, fine. Yeah, no, that'll work. Okay. There we go. There we go. He's beginning to believe. Ow. Ow. I... Uh, 
There we go. Let's see, I've always struggled with the back stats in this game. Because it's one of those, like, you gotta find what the back... <laughs> what the back is. And, uh... Yeah, always been tricky. Um, okay, do I just keep doing this? Or... Is 720 souls actually enough to level up? I honestly don't remember. Does this tell you? No. No, they were still doing the thing where they didn't tell you how many souls you needed. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, God, that's annoying. <laughs> the weapons deal more damage after a dodge attack. Yeah, I know. I know. We're going to play through the whole game today? Uh, uh, highly unlikely. <laughs> we'll see. Highly unlikely, but we'll see. All right. Hello. How many blood souls do I need? 829. Actually, you know what? I probably have some of the loose ones rolling around in my inventory here. I do not. Interesting. Okay. I must have popped those to help get this weapon. Cool. Well, we can just use these souls then to uh, buy some blood pots. There we go. All right. That, that helps. There we go. All righty. Can you only use the blades or can you use throwing weapons? You can only use the blades. Can only use the blades. So, uh, Augur of Abrietas is, uh, not an option, unfortunately. Was my first Soulsborne game? Uh, I can't remember if it was Dark Souls or Demon Souls. I want to say it was Dark Souls 1. I want to say. What's your thought on the Beast Cutter? Have you used it? Um, is the Beast Cutter the one from the DLC? Yeah, because the other one's the Saw Cleaver. Uh, haven't really used it. Didn't strike me as my kind of weapon. Seemed kind of, uh, a little too slow, a little too heavy for my taste. Come on. Come on. There you go. Let's see if I can just kind of... Man, wow, okay, you got, a, like, a sixth attack there, huh? I think the chat's right. We're just going to have to get good at dodging. Which means I'm going to need some stamina. And health. <laughs> we got a lot of stats I need to pour into today, unfortunately. More than two. And I don't think having a... Wow. Insta-killed. Um, yeah, I don't think having low vitality in this run is going to be an option. <laughs> so that's cool. Am I play, gonna play Armored Core 6 on the channel? I don't know. Probably not for a while. Um, I have been playing it here and there, though. Slowly making my way through. Slowly waking, making my way through that game. We're gonna use the old Hunter's Bone? Uh, never used it. Don't know. Don't? What the? Really? Really? You, of all people? Man. Okay, so these daggers are terrible at uh, doing poise damage, so that's not good. That's not helpful. Yeah, Beast Cutter's the strength version of the Threaded Cane. Yeah, nah. Doesn't sound like my kind of thing. Have I played any more Elden Ring since I streamed it? Uh, if you're talking about on the second channel, yes, I did. Uh, though not very much. And, uh... Definitely fell off of it, and I was just like, yeah, yeah no, nah, I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want it. Armored Core came out, and everything else is going on, and I'm just like, I don't I don't have time for this right now. Denial. Yay, a lemon stream. Watched the grime yesterday, and off, uh, got off work for Bloodborne. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, no, the grime thing is funny. I'm, uh, I'm real excited about that. I am very excited about that run. That's going to be a good time. They do arcane as well. They do arcane as well, yes, but it's... I don't think it's... Christ. I don't think it's any more than any other weapon does. Like, I think the scaling... Oh, actually, no, wait. Oh, you may be right. Yeah, you're right, there is just a little bit of arcane, just, just kind of chilling there. Hmm. I don't know what the scaling on that is, though. I think... I think we're better off leaning into the skill side of things for now. Is it always 12 damage, or am I just... Yeah, and this is like 18. Okay, so... So the dual daggers do like... 75%? Is that what that is? 
hard to say. Yeah, I saw that brick coming. <laughs> I saw that brick coming. That wasn't gonna happen. Uh, all right. Well, 15 health pots is probably enough. We can we can push forward. We can push forward. We'll be all right. Shadow God, be yourself. Honestly, if you're doing anything else, you're doing it wrong. But always remember, there's two people involved in that equation. So if it's not working, you gotta respect that. And that's just the way it goes. Alright, that's cool. Dark Whisper Stories. More like Blades of Begging for Mercy. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> First thoughts on Armored Core so far? It's, uh, it's been fun. I've been enjoying it. Um... I've enjoyed also how easy it is for me to just kind of pick it up, play it, and then put it down for, like, several days. And then come back to it and feel like I'm, I know exactly what's going on. Like, I don't have any issues with, like, alright, where am I? What am I doing? Because I can always replay all the missions, and it's so mission-based. So I do like that quite a bit. Um, yeah, no, it's it's been a good time so far. Really glad I get to jump back into Armored Core. All right, let's try this again. A little big boy. Let's see what we can do. God, that damage. God, this camera. All right. I'm thinking. Mr. Yells a lot over here. Ha ha! <laughs> dodged, stab, dodge. God, we might have to. Ow. Ow. Always with the hitting. Fuck. Alright, and we gotta know when to get out of here. Gotta learn when to get in, learn when to get out. Oh. And that was not when we were supposed to get in. <laughs> Good. Oh, there you are. What are you doing over here? Get that damage, though. Yeah, I know, right? This is pro the damage itself is probably why I never gave these weapons like a second thought, where I was just like, eh, nope, <laughs> just because of how how shitty they are. It's amazing how little damage they do. A lot of people swear by them, though. So I mean, there's got to be something that I'm missing here. It's just got to be maybe it's like a late game kind of build, but um, but yeah, oof. Alright, I'm starting to warm up. We're starting to warm up. I'm remembering how much dodging and aggression I need to do. We're starting to get there. The time is coming back. Just gotta shake off the rust. You know how it goes. Alright. Recharging? Okay. better this time. Spoke too soon. Spoke too soon. What the hell? <laughs> Give a man a break. You know what? I'm not wearing a headpiece. Maybe I should put that on. Actually, I have lots of better armor. What am I doing? Okay. Maybe that'll help a little bit. We live in hope. Everyone knows fashion is very important in a Souls game. Oh, Christ, okay. Now well, we're doing better than last time, I think. Kind of hard to tell. I can't really see what's happening on screen. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Uh. There's a hit. Ooh, we're gonna take advantage of that. Yes, please. There we go. Alright, now we're talking, now we're talking.
There he goes. Now he's breaking. Now he's breaking. Yeah, cameras. <laughs> the camera in this fight. <laughs> I can't. Right, he's healing all. I don't know if that, I don't remember if that heals all of his limbs or just one. I think it heals. All, I think it just heals one. Which way he's like, still bleeding out of a leg over there. Yeah. Okay. No, he just healed that leg. All right. What are you doing? What are you doing? Sweep the leg. Sweep the leg, Johnny. Ow. Oh, oh. Oh, come on. Ooh, okay. Not even close. We're fine. Everything's fine. Put him in a body bag. All right. Woo. Okay, we don't have to listen to the screams anymore. Good lord. I'm taking these bullets as a penalty. All right. Holy shit. That was a thing, huh? Jack Storm, coming back for five months. Thank you so much. Who else did I miss while I was out there? Let's see. I missed... Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Been a hot minute. Uh, looks like the chat has moved past it. So whoever else joined during that, I apologize. But thank you for joining us. I appreciate that. Okay. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Let's go. The only way to play this game is on PlayStation? Yep. Unfortunately. Mm, all right, what does that do for us? A whopping three damage, you say? Four damage, excuse me. <laughs> four levels, four damage. That's <laughs> that's what we're looking at. Uh, do it. That'll be bigger later. When we start upgrading this thing, it'll be bigger. But we have to clear gas coin before we can actually upgrade it. So that's kind of a thing. Um, Great bridge. Oh, right. I was like, what the hell is that? Okay, cool. Yay, let's go. <laughs> let's keep going. Would I recommend picking up Armored Core? If you like Armored Core games, yeah. That would be the one. That would be the one. Weary Traveler, eight months. Amazing, first try. Might be good for some sippy break. Good time for some sippy break. That reminds me. My tea has been steeping. I should have not... Let it continue. You're right, chat. Let's get a little sippy break going, huh? Celebratory dirty water. My favorite. All right, let's move on. Let's move on. Uh, someone asked, uh, after now having played Elden Ring for several more hours, uh, if my opinion has changed. It has not. Not really. Um... Also, Hakasi coming back for seven months. Thank you so much. Um, it's like I get where where everyone's coming from. I understand why it's a good game, but I honestly think it's just the layout is just not for me. I've I've come to terms that it is in fact an open world game, like through and through. And unfortunately, I don't think I like open world games. Um, I do like games. What was it? Like Skyrim? I had a really good time with Skyrim, which is definitely an open world game. Um, I can't say I've really played any other ones. Um, but the problem there is that Skyrim has a lot going on, right? Like, it's not... Dark Souls... Or not Dark Souls. Elden Ring is... Uh, the world is very open. There's a lot going on. But everywhere you go, it's just, all right, what am I hitting next? Like, what what am I killing next? There's very little world going on. It's just a larger sandbox to hit things in. Um, 
Skyrim, you could, you're like uh, putting rat poison in beer and you're uh, running around doing other stuff. Like there's always something else going on in Skyrim. So it's definitely a bit different. Um, like I can steal all the potatoes and put them all in a single room. I can uh, be, be a stealth archer. I can uh, ride a dragon, you know, like all that kind of stuff. Can't really do any of that in Elden Ring. Elden Ring, you get to pick different types of magic, different types of weapon, and, and how hard you hit people with it. So, um, so for that fact alone, unfortunately, it's just not my type of game. And that's just the way it's going to go. That's just the way it's going to go, and we all just have to live with it. No. Health pots? Health pots? No health pots? Okay. Don't you dare cheese gas going? I would never. Cheese and my good gothic game? You insult me, sir. Have I tried Starfield yet? I have not. No. Alright. You think lots of people disagree, but Souls games tend to lend themselves better to a 10 to 14 hour experience than an open world? I would agree with you. I think they do better when they are a bit more streamlined or uh, a bit more focused. I feel like the lore benefits from that. I feel like the combat benefits from that. The setup. I would say it just does a better job that, and when that's the case. But some people really like the open world stuff, so, you know, to each their own. It's all good. It's all good. Mm -mm -mm. All right. So let's see here. Here's my dude. We're gonna we're gonna see what we're working with here. Excellent, solid, beautiful damage. Okay. Okay. Yep. Good. Yep. Excellent. All right. A fine start. Uh, <laughs> that's good. That's good. Did we get the music box? We did, yeah. I'm holding on to that. We're gonna see We're gonna see if we can fight him normally first, and then we're going to uh push him into beast mode and we'll just go that route. We will see. We will see. Sandor, if you wanna ask something, you gotta ask it, bud. That's how this works. Yeah, we're still getting used to the weapon. The weapon's damage is, uh, how do you say, very bad. So, we're kind of in the early stages of, oh god, why does everything hurt? Please help. Um, hopefully, we get away from that stage sooner rather than later. I'm going to try and lure you and just you. I don't want to mess with your twin over there. Maybe you can give me some, some free blood vials? You know, if you're feeling generous? No? Not feeling generous? Alright. It's just a mask. Couldn't hurt to ask. Thought I'd be nice. Now I'll just take them. All right, well. All right, I can smack dead bodies and still get some health back. All right. Ooh. There we go. Nice. There we go. Shiny coins, Ugh, whatever, <laughs> whatever. Because Bloodborne makes you scale down to the host, is it cheating to summon help who uses the Blades of Mercy as well? Uh, I don't have online. I refuse to pay for my internet twice. On principle. So, there will be no summons whatsoever. How's the SNS2 wiki coming? Uh, it's currently on pause due to uh, the DLC coming out and them kind of altering a couple numbers and things here so I don't want to keep putting more information into it when things are changing uh, that said though uh, somebody did actually make a map so we will have a map full of it where to find all the items and stuff when that when uh, when everything else comes out so that's pretty cool maybe use the edited challenge dungeon so you don't have to farm blood vials uh see my previous explanation of i don't have online <laughs> all right Woo. stab stab Ow. What? 
Okay, hold on. All right, you and that... I hate that shotgun so much. Okay. All right, all right. We can work with that. Seems like we can kind of bully him a little bit here and there. There we go. Oops. Oops, you can hit me on the ground. Okay. Man, I wish this thing had some actual poise damage. Oh my god. Okay, wow. Just kind of just kept going there, huh? Hoo, boy. Nice. All Chalice Dungeons are available offline? Incorrect. Uh, the ones they're talking about, the ones that are glitched, or rather, like, where you type in a code, that is not available offline. Why don't you try to parry? Because a gun is not the Blades of Mercy, my guy. If I could parry, we'd be, we'd be soaring through this game. If I could parry, we'd be doing it just fine. There we go. All right, let's try this again. Woo. Monster Hunter World videos when? Uh, when I can think of an actual challenge for them. It's uh, unfortunately one of those games that's like, mm, everything is kind of viable and... <laughs> oh, you know what? We could probably, maybe we could backstab Gascoigne. Probably not, but, but you know, I forgot that that's an option. I'm starting to get used to this backstab thing. We're starting to get it. Okay, okay, there we go. Now we're talking. Yeah, music box and the backstab, that's probably a great, that's a great idea. Let's, um, tiny music box. Teeny tiny living space. Items only in Monster Hunter? Uh, it's the problem with most of the Monster Hunter runs is that they're just tedious. It's like, yeah. Now, uh, you have unlimited items because you can always go back to your box. But as soon as you run out of items, you're going to have to go back to your box and then come back and then go back to your box and then come back. So I'm actually, I'm not doing any Monster Hunter World runs right now. However, I am doing, um, 2020, oh Jesus Christ. I am doing the, uh, Wild Hearts run. There we go. No one going to drop me a thing? No, just some bullets? Okay, cool, thanks. Uh, the Wild Hearts run, which is you only use the, their whole gimmick in that game is like, you have this thing called a Karakuri, uh, which just, like, you can make things out of thin air. So I am slowly beating the game with just that, and it's been, uh, it's been a hoot. It has been a hoot. Hey, do you have some things? DP Reactions and Andy, welcome to Firebomb Academy. I hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. What's the transform move set? Uh, it is a dual dagger, which is fine and dandy, and does pretty good, but not great. Zimadias, welcome. Woo. God, that damage though. Yeah, you probably can't get a backstab in unless he's stunned by the music box, huh? How's it feel to be getting killed by one of your own weapons, huh? Ow. Guess that answers that. Can you not? Can you not? Alright, let's... Again with the stabbing. Again with the stabbing, my dude. to do that next to a next to a thing that's fine there we go there we go that's better there's a good chunk of damage it's <laughs> a little confused though oh, missed it uh -oh. 
All right, well. Game time, who? Let's go. I might be better at this moveset. We'll find out. Ooh! What are you doing? Yeah, this is a bit more predictable for me. I struggle with the hunters. I don't think that has a gun. <laughs> I can't... I struggle to fight things with that can shoot me from long range. This is this is a little easier for me. Hello. Oh, forgot you have a. I forgot you have a kick. Oopsies. Get my get my two cents in there. There we go. Angry, wow. Turn up the kick. Two. Turn up the kick. Go for the R2. Easy. Easy. Ooh. We should actually be going for the. Circle R1, that's the most damage. Okay, well, you need to give me a minute here. Hold on now. Yeah, yeah that, that seems to be our our ticket. Magisterian, thank you. I will read that in a minute. Oh, I see what you wrote. Yeah, you, ca you came at just the right time, didn't you? oof -a. Running low on health pots. Pick better times to attack him. Nope. Kick. Take what damage we can get. Here we go. It's coming along, chipping him away. Don't like this corner we're slowly ducking into here. All right. Hold on now. Hold on now. Let me do this is. Attack pattern I recognize. Good. Good. There we go. Why did I pick those up? What was I thinking? Oh, God. Magic pixel. <laughs> mm. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> he got me on the back swing. Oh, damn it. <laughs> One HP in a dream, baby. Almost. Almost. Okay. Ah, oh, we were close. That's okay. That's okay. Um, yeah, I have a much better time fighting his beast mode than his regular mode, so we are going to lean into that. We are going to lean into that. It may be a little loud, but we're going to lean in. What are you doing hitting me in that last attack like that? What do you think this is, huh? Give me that blood vial. Alrighty. Can we do AC6 melee only? Melee is one of your best options in that game. Uh, but you all have overlooked the fact that there is a flamethrower in that game? Just saying? 
so uh yeah well we're gonna let zero lenny have the melee only run for a bit um and when i finally beat uh armored core then we can look into doing things like that but that we're probably about six or seven months out from me doing any kind of armored core runs for being completely honest so you got time to beat the game yourself if you haven't done so already you got time i won't spoil you all righty five five seems like a reasonable amount for this Grenade cannons. Uh, the grenade launchers that I've played around with in that game are pretty slow. Uh, so a lot of enemies just kind of dodge away and waste your ammo. So I don't think that's really like a viable build, unfortunately. For, for everything, anyway. How good is Armored Core? It's a great Armored Core game. I would say it is a great Armored Core game. Um, if you are looking for more Dark Souls, do not buy Armored Core. But if you want some more Armored Core, buy Armored Core. <laughs> yeah, if anyone is comparing it to Dark Souls, I don't know how. Uh, it is completely apples and oranges. Completely different game. What's the transform attack? Oh, it's a weird attack. What's this L2? It's like a back hop? Hmm, okay. But it's the Dark Souls of Dark Souls! Yeah, well. <laughs> Dark Souls got really weird. Dark Souls 4 is <laughs> a bit different than Dark Souls 3. There we go. Go for the Achilles. Break him down. Nine's pretty good. Ooh. See if I can... Weedle one out of ya. Come on. Dang it. Alright. That's fine. We'll take it. That's fine. We'll take it. Okay. Yeah, a little bit of music box. Cool. Thank you. Don't get to take advantage of that hit. That's fine. Gonna try again. Can you please stop hitting me and just accept that I can play music better than you? Alright, well. Can't backstab you, though. Not good at that. <laughs> there we go. Got one at least. Well, at least we got one. Okay. Can I get one? Oh, he was immune. Ooh. Actually, you know what? We are just going to go with the short sword version now. That's some pretty decent damage. For this thing. <laughs> Let's not get carried away here. Uh, William! Thank you. Very kind of you. Appreciate you. And Nick! Do we need to add them to the drinking game? Uh, what drinking game is that? <laughs> Ow, for fuck's sake. Hmm. Well, at least we didn't waste a bunch of, uh, blood vials. Ah, boy. Kite him towards the stairs is easier to dodge him up there. Yeah, it probably is. Get him, getting him away from all the random... Uh... Thing. <laughs> Brain. Brain not work. Help! Oh, when Chad asked about Elden Ring drink. Oh, okay. No, because I will eventually... Like, I'm enjoying Elden Ring... Or, not Elden Ring. God. Uh, I am enjoying Armored Core, and I'm actually playing Armored Core in my off time. So, when people ask, are you playing it? It's like, yeah, no, I am. Like, it's a valid question. Um, with Elden Ring, it's kind of like... Yeah, maybe you can throw that into the, the go ahead and drink thing, because... Uh, well, I mean, I haven't... Elden Ring's been out for, what, almost two years now, I think? One year? Two years? I don't even know. Uh, and I have not put out a single piece of content for it. If you're asking me about it at this point, you should know. Like, you, the context clues are there. I don't know what to tell you, <laughs> you know? We're not going to cheese him on the stairs. I'm just going to bring him up there. Oh, wow, four. Nice. Uh, I'm just going to bring him up in that general direction. 
because it's easier and there's less gravestones to work around. It's not cheesing him if it's if we're just bringing him to a better battle zone. Do you take my love? Thank you. There we go. There we go. That's a healthy amount there. We should do a Dark Souls 2 run where you follow the IGN guide. Uh, that is completely derivative of uh, what's his name? Is that Zero Lenny? I want to say that's Zero Lenny. So, uh, no, we will not be doing that. Liam! Best luck the run. It's late here and you have to work tomorrow. Completely understand. Thanks for, uh, thanks for being very healthy with yourself there and your, uh, your content consumption. Proud of you, bud. The VOD will be here for you. Have a good one. Run away! Okay. Just please! Man. Cheesing him would be making him get stuck on the graves? Ah, oh, sure, yeah. That's right, you can do that, can't you? Yeah, that's right, you can do that, can't you? Uh, <laughs> oh, what was that? <laughs> Never seen that move. There we go. I do have gloves, yes. But I'm definitely not washing them between uses, though. Hoping for one more. That's okay. 17 is good. Let's go. Any tips for role playing as a hunter in D and D? Uh, if you're talking about like a Bloodborne hunter, no. And if you're talking about how do I play as the hunter class, also no. I don't think I've ever played as a hunter before. What are you doing? What are you doing? What is this? What do you think this is, huh? Oh man, look at all those souls, though. If we survive this, boys, we're eating good tonight. There we go, there's one. Come on. Come on, feel the noise. There it is. Oh, I think I missed it. Oh, no, we got it. Nice. Alright, and run away. He sounds angry. Are we not using a gun at all? Nope. That's why this run is so hard. All right, big boy. Let's go. Now I can see what I'm doing. There's no random coffins in front of me. Well, I mean, there are, but ow. Ow. Uh-oh, 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 we're fine. Everything's fine. I'm trying to think, should I go? Is there a time where you can go for the uh, backstab? I don't think he sits still long enough. We can get the damage, so I mean, it's not a deal, but ow. Not without a parry. Oof. Easy there. Oh, that might be a time. That might be a moment. We can always take advantage of that. Maybe that there. Tight window. That is a tight window. I don't know. I don't think we're gonna need it. I think we're gonna be fine. Too tight. Too tight. Yeah. Oh, come on now. Seriously? <laughs> I was dodging. I was in the middle of a dodge. <laughs> oh, no. Man. Hmm. 
will be using hunter items or weapon buffs. Uh, so the Blades of Mercy cannot use uh, weapon buffs of any kind. So you can't buff them with the fire paper or anything like that. Um, so that's unfortunate. Uh, and as far as other items go, like, we're not going to be using Molotovs or anything of that nature, if that's what you're asking. That would be helpful. Like, if we could use Molotovs right now, we would have won. Because it's like 10 Molotovs to kill. <laughs> to kill him once he transforms. Would have been no time at all. Gunless gas coin is legit tough. Yeah, no, gunless everything in this game is tough. Like, a lot of people kind of forget that. A lot of people would be like, oh, you're just using a weapon? Oh, that's not very hard. And then you're just like, yeah, okay. Uh, do you remember the part where <laughs> this entire game's combat is based around the, the gun that you have in your left hand? Because, uh... Because <laughs> it is! What? Are you kidding me? Alright. You just... You just die a normal death. I'll take that. Use one of them. Even the trolls are annoying without guns? Oh, for sure. Thankfully, they have this backstab that they're sometimes prone to giving me, but... What is that attack? What is the... What's going on with that? But yeah, no, you're supposed to be parrying everything. You're absolutely supposed to be parrying everything. Will we be making a playthrough of this? I'd like to. I would like to. I'm currently recording, so... Here's open, but uh, but if it starts to get really rough and I'm like, ah, my efforts are best better spent elsewhere, then maybe not. We'll see though. Why not use Blades of Mercy two-handed in the second phase? Because there's always the chance that we might be able to squeeze in a backstab, and you cannot backstab when it is two-handed. That's why. Ooh. Egg bread and rats. All right, enjoy the fireball. Nice. I'm gonna let you live. Who's hotter, Rom or Mikolaj? Uh, clearly, Rom. Best potato. It's Rom. She can leave the spiders at home, though. I don't. I don't need those. <laughs> Good morning, Chewy Games. Almost right there with you. I woke up to my alarm for once. All right, a bit of music for you. I have the wrong version of my weapon. That didn't help. Let's try this again. Okay. A backstab action. There we go. There we go. Oh, you're feeling it. What I was doing there. That's okay. What's some music? A little background music. Oh. Not early enough. Okay. Well, here we go. Run away. Run away! You always try to use the blaze and they just feel bad? Same. <laughs> What's happening? Yeah, they, uh... Unless the damage really takes off when we start upgrading these things, this is going to be a, a hell of a run. I'm going to pick up these souls because there's actually quite a bit of them. There's that. Almost. I mean, worst case scenario, we're doing lots of damage. It's not good. Let's go for the... Oh, 
course, the one moment, I, <laughs> the one time I switched over, it's the one time I might have been able to get a backstab in. Go figure. Can you not, my dude? Oh, seriously? Got some weird hitbox on that one there, dude. Does the music box affect him in beast mode? Like, to, like, still stun him a little bit? I feel like the answer is no. Nope. Okay, help out. For good reason! I might have tried the L2 and it did not connect. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We got him. We got him. Alright. This wall has something to say about it, apparently. Come on. Come on. What is this attack? Why are you jumping? There we go. Jesus. Woo! Okay. Take the brooch. Take the key. Take this. Take those souls. Fucking hell, okay. Fucking hell. We did it! Not bad, 40 minutes later, yep. <laughs> to be fair, some of that was the Cleric Beast, so I mean, give me a little credit, but... But yeah, ooh baby. Alright. Let's get the upgrade thing. Let's get the upgrade thing. That way we can actually make this weapon good. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Why didn't we get any injuries? What injuries? What injuries? Hey, Press, how's it going, man? Only the entire rest of the game remaining. That's right, baby. That's right. It only gets worse from here. Pyro, thanks for suffering to give us great content. Anytime. Anytime. Are there poison gems in the base game? There are, uh, but poison in Bloodborne is not good. I don't think it's meant for PvE. I'm pretty sure. Like, the, the build-up is so abysmal that it's just, like, not even worth it. At least I'm pretty sure, anyway. Having a nice 3 p.m. breakfast. <laughs> uh, don't know that life. <laughs> oh, you know what? Hold on. Before I channel all the things, let me run up here and upgrade this thing at least once. Okay. This one. All right, what do we got? I have the three bloodstone shards. It's going to go from 60 to 66. That is what we call progress. Um, and this can afford one blood gem. It's saying I don't have any, but oh, contraire. I do have this thing. 
Smash. All right. There we go. A little extra, little 3% damage boost right there. Can't go wrong. The masterworks all, you can't go wrong. Now let's turn this out of here and pump into something. What are we pumping? Boop, 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 boop. All right, all right. Four levels, five damage. We're starting to see the effects here. That's good, that's good. Broke Mage, gifting 10 scholarships. Thank you so much. Which, uh, I didn't even look at which one I've been to. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I just warped to a random place. Cool. What's my favorite weapon in Bloodborne? Uh, the claws. The beast claws, by far. Because they are also like dual daggers, but they increase in damage as you go. Which is pretty solid. We're not going to do any of this. Let's just... I, I clicked the wrong place. It's been a while. How's it, have I been? Oh, we've been rocking and rolling over here. It's been very busy. Very busy lately. Lots going on for sure. Alright, let's go to the actual place here. Cathedral Ward. There we go. That's better. Much better. Are we ever going to do another marathon of any other game series? Um... I don't even know what other kind of game series we'd do a marathon of, you know, like what sh the problem with that is always like, I need to know the game series inside and out. That way I can actually hope to God that uh, we can get through it uh, at a reasonable era, uh, reasonable pace. So, um, yeah, SMB marathon. I don't even know what that is. I don't even know what that is. Is this? Oh, no. She's not there. Okay, so let's see. Uh, not this way. That is the wrong way to go. We need to go this way. I'm trying to remember. <laughs> Surge Marathon. First off, there's only two. And second off, I've never even played the second one. Nor beaten the first. Because I got so tired of the garbage. Okay, so... Semi-decent damage. Not bad can run right into the oh god hello what are you doing here yeah that r1 that that dodge r1 is actually really good would you drop me oh thanks here we go should we get the top hat let's get the top hat gotta look stylish in the top hat oh yes indeed there we go Yeah, so I don't know. Uh, as far as, like, just future marathons go, probably not for a while anyway. Um, we're coming up on the 33% of the way to a million mark, which is pretty cool. But I don't think we're going to, like, celebrate it. Because we already did 25%, so I don't really want to do that. So we'll probably just... Um, there we go. That's good. We like all that. Oh, oh, I need you. oh don't disappear. Papa? I can still hear the screams, Papa! Ugh, there we go. There we go. Uh, but, uh, yeah, no. We'll, um... I forgot what I was talking about. I, I panicked, and I was trying to grab things. Ah, uh, Phantom of Time! Well, time to get England up in this run. Oh, yeah? Uh-huh. <laughs> I guess so. And Torito. Rhymes with Dorito. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Will I ever try Blasphemous 2? Probably not. Uh, I do... I am actually plotting... It's going to be a while, but I am plotting for the next We Need to Talk, and the, we the next We Need to Talk is going to be about Blasphemous. Um, simply because I feel like my f video from like two years ago now uh, doesn't do my opinion on the game justice. That's fine. Um... Yeah, it doesn't really do the game justice or my opinion on it justice. And so I feel like we need to kind of go back to that and actually talk about it properly. And I have a small feeling that uh, playing Blasphemous 1 through to the end again is probably not going to improve my opinion on the series. So I probably won't be dipping into Blasphemous 2. I'm sure they fixed a lot of stuff, and I'm glad they did if that's the case. But 
Uh, it's just not for me, I don't think. I think it's just not the series for me, that's all. You're just gonna keep turning around. No peeking! Jeez, guy, come on, man, ruin the surprise. We're just gonna leave him alone. Alright. It's not even the same type of game anymore? Really? Okay, I didn't know that. I thought it would just be another Metroidvania. I figured it'd be another Metroidvania of sorts, but, uh... Take your word for it. It also doesn't help that YouTube doesn't like Blasphemous. Uh, it tends to demonetize it immediately, so... Not good for business, either. Alright, let's go this way. We got enough blood gems. Or not blood gems. Well, we do have a new blood gem, but we also got a couple more things for an upgrade, so that's good. I think that's our key. That's the strat for right now. We need to upgrade the damage, which means we need to upgrade the weapon. If we can do that, we'll be golden. I think we're going the right way for all that. Some do, some stuff I can't use. Was my main gripe about Blast was I didn't reward exploring very much? Uh, that was one of them. Uh, but no. My main gripe was that the mechanics were all super unfriendly to the player. To the point where it made playing it a chore. Um, like for example, it stuck the lore first on every item. Which is like, yeah, cool, I'm glad you like your lore. I'm glad you're excited about it and want to tell me about it. Um, I need to know what this thing does. <laughs> like, I, does this thing boost my defense or does it do something else? I don't know, and I have to scroll down to even see the effect. Uh, so that was kind of a bummer. The fact that you cannot tell what enemies are safe to walk into and which ones are not is a huge problem. Um, like, you can't tell me I can, I can dodge through certain enemies, but then when I try to dodge through certain enemies, I just get hit. It doesn't... That's not okay. That's not good game design. Give me a give me a flash or something. Like give me some sort of visual indicator that this is a safe time to dodge. So Yeah, just stuff like that. Um I'll get into detail later when I've had more time to kind of marinate on it and make sure I have a well presented argument. I don't need people just telling me to get good again. <laughs> it's like okay. <laughs> So, not that we can't take the heat. I mean, we did do the Dark Souls video, so uh, we don't need that item. We can't use anything with that. And some of the some of the cope and or fanboyism in the in that comment section was, "Whoo, tell me you're under the age of 18 without telling me you're under the age of 18." I tell you. But uh, but yeah, we'll be fine. We'll 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 form our arguments. We'll write it down and we'll call it good. And that'll be that. Guitar dunce. Hit too close to home for you? Yeah. I I mean, don't get me wrong. I also feel that. But also, uh, I was able to set that aside and recognize that there was also just a bad game underneath all that. So, or in my opinion, there was a bad game underneath the rest of it as well. Is that the moment? I forget when I'm supposed to backstab these guys. Okay. What I would give for just a, a normal backstab <laughs> would be nice. Would would pay. Would pay for a mod that just gave me regular fucking backstabs in this game. <laughs> Plus no shard, though. How many of those do we got? Eleven. We needed five and eight. Which is, uh, thirteen. Okay, we can get thirteen. That's no problem. We're coming up in the last two here. Awesome. Saying good good is a toxic anti advice. Oh yeah, no, that's that's not that is not legitimate advice in any stretch of the imagination. Hmm. Saying good good is called gatekeeping. That is you being upset that other people are playing your game and uh, able to play the game, quote unquote, less better than you, and still enjoy it, and that makes you upset because now you you've put the time in. Oop, there we go. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a whole thing. 
<laughs> it's a whole thing. We're not going to get into it now. I'll just get mad. I'll just get mad. Are you on the 60 frames patch? God, you wish. <laughs> no. There's, you need to break your... Uh, I think you need to break your PS4 for that, don't you? Your jailbreak it, rather. Do I have any interest in Baldur's Gate 3? I have interest in it, but I have not touched it yet. I own it. It's there. I'm not, uh, I'm not ready. I'm not ready to lose that much time. <laughs> you want to make a game with a good item? It does nothing but looks pretty. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. All right, let's see here. Actually, while we're here, maybe we just go back to that... Back to our guy up here. Uh, no, let's go this way. Ana uh, Ananim. Thank you so much. Appreciate ya. No, you may not. And Phantom. Ever played Castlevania Symphony of the Night? I have not. No. Mm -hmm. No, I... Uh, contrary to popular belief, not really... Not really a fan of Metroidvanias. Um, just, I don't like to backtrack. Uh, so that's kind of the whole thing, usually, with a Metroidvania. So, just not my type of game. Why not steaming Salt and Sacrifice? I mean, streaming. Um, <laughs> salt is hard to steam. Well, there you go. <laughs> Chan answered that question, didn't they? Uh, I cannot play Salt and Sacrifice right now. My version of Salt and Sacrifice is different than everyone else's. Uh, so... Oh, damn it, you bastard. Um, we'll have to go back for him. So, yeah, so I cannot play the game live right now. Hey, torch. When, uh, when they release it proper and has the DLC to everybody, then, uh, then we will be playing that plenty. We'll probably just play through the game normally and then everyone can invade me. It'll be a good time. But, uh, but yeah, we got to wait on them though, unfortunately. Not so much an NDA, just a, I don't want to spoil things for people. There we go. Yet you managed to forget to place the Lord Vessel so many times. Placing the Lord Vessel isn't really, I would argue it's not like backtracking. Does this guy respawn? Eh, we'll just do it normal. Well, I'm just going back again. It's fine. I'll do it. It's fine. Um, yeah. I would argue that the Lord Vessel is not a problem because uh, you literally just warp there and then you put it there. <laughs> like That's not backtracking. That's fast forwarding yourself to where it needs to go. Uh, backtracking is going all, like making it so that you have to go all the way back through an entire area and you have to sift through the entire area looking to see what's changed. Where's the, where can you use the item? That kind of thing. I don't like that. That annoys me. That's why I like Grime, though, because while it it lets you do that and rewards you for doing that, you don't have to do that. You can just push forward the entire time, and it's a-okay. So, I wish I wish more Metroidvanias were like that, and less like Metroid. Broke Mage, good lord. Thank you so much, my man. You agree on the get good equals gatekeeping? Yeah. Yeah, for sure. He was stuck on Pontiff for weeks. Oh, oof, yeah, I feel that. Mm-mm. All I needed was a little help. Yep, exactly. Like, most people do. Like, most people are just like, hey, I just don't understand this mechanic. Can you fill me in? And then, if you do, they'll make it. But so many people... There we go. We have all the blood gems we need. Or, I keep calling them blood gems. Blood shards. Blood shards. Everything is blood. Um, so many people would just benefit from just a little bit of advice. But the problem is that also, so many people are... They wrap up their identities into a game... Or their accomplishments of a game. And when they do that, anyone who's able to do what they did is now a threat. Right? Like, if I say, like, yeah, I like to use uh, the big weapon that just hits things. It's great. There's going to be that one guy that goes, like, oh, you used summons? Oh, well, then you didn't actually beat the game. It's like, N go fuck yourself. It's part of the game. Like, <laughs> you beat the game. You're fine. You did it. Good job. There's... If anyone tells you your method of play is is invalid, just tell them to kick rocks. Their opinion is invalid. 
you know the only t- and i hate to say it but that's kind of like a mentality that's kind of come from uh more multiplayer games uh simply because like for example i don't know if any of you have seen it but folding ideas is video on why it's rude to be bad at War- world of warcraft uh great ga- great movie great movie great youtube video um but he basically explains like how it started off where you could just kind of like walk around with no shoes you could role play as the druid that doesn't wear shoes and it was fun and everyone was having a good time and over time the game slowly evolved into being the best of the best you have to have the best items you have to have the best gear you have to have the best version of the best gear uh and it became rude and bad to not have all that and so you walking around uh you walking around with no shoes suddenly meant that you were not a valuable player and that you were playing the game wrong and that you should be ignored. Like, it was encouraged to ignore those people that were just having fun with the game, you know? Uh, so, yeah. I think that sometimes seeps into the Bloodborne slash Dark Souls community, uh, and you hate to see it. Woo! Ow! Ow! All right, hey, let's, uh, ooh, look at that damage. Actual damage? What? <laughs> Hold on a minute. I was just quietly upgrading these things to plus three, and all of a sudden I'm seeing 150 damage on my screen. Okay, not, uh, never mind, just 50, but hey, you know, <laughs> we'll take what we can get. Stop hitting me. I'm trying to comment on your weakness. All right, let's go. There's nothing else here for us. Let's move forward. I am a skilled hunter. Thank you, as I'm being smacked around by beast. Corey, special thanks to your Dark Souls guide five years ago for hand-holding you through the Dark Souls 3 in high school. I thought I grabbed that ladder. I did not. That's fine. Starting your love for the series. Yeah, see? Like, that's what I mean. Like, that's what's good. Like, just to help a friend through. We do not need to kill you. Uh, what's his face up there? So we're not going to. And Broke Mage coming back for seven months. He had a short sword plus four and was blocking with a buckler. He definitely needed help, but he had plenty of skill. Oh man, he had he didn't even <laughs> he didn't even upgrade. Oh. Yeah, poor guy. I'm glad you helped him out there. Yeah, no. We all we all benefit when we all help each other through a game. If someone is playing a game weird, cool. You're learning something new. Like that's awesome. Like encourage that. Tell them how to play, like tell them how to play in a manner that'll help them perhaps like if they're struggling but other than that like just let them let them fly man it's how we get weird shit and we love it it's how we get the weird shit what do you have you have something good in here hold on i'm busy wait your turn wait your turn oh my god all right hold on okay all right <laughs> Uh, that's fine. That's okay. I need a sippy break. Ugh. Ah, that's better. That's better. That's better. They didn't feel like waiting. No, they did not. Like Cat and the Firebombs? Exactly, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, when Cat told me all about uh, <laughs> how, how cheap the Firebombs were, and she's just like, I just want to use them. I was like, uh, okay. There are only 50 souls. They can't be that good. But, uh, no, she was right. She was right. It was an overlooked... I should have known. <laughs> Typical Dark Souls. It was an overlooked balancing issue, and the firebombs were amazing. Go figure. Shadow, I'm going to call you out on that, buddy. You've been saying you've got to go for, the, like, the last hour and a half. You can move on, bud. It's okay. See you later. All right. You plan on going into Elden Ring as blind as possible? Uh, same. I have seen nothing about it, aside from what I've seen with my own two eyes. And, uh, yep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that could be half my battle. I know that's what it was with Dark Souls 1 initially, was that I just uh, didn't know anything about it, and what I did see, I wasn't impressed with. Uh, and then I started watching the lore videos, and then I, like... It was like, okay, hold on. There's something behind. Like, I just need to push through to the rest of the lore that I'm actually going to enjoy. Um, there we go. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. So there might be some of that, but I don't know. I just don't know. 
You know, we could probably put another blood gem on here. The one hand transform attack on the blade is your B and B. My bread and butter. Is it? I don't know. That sounds not great. One hand transform attack. So like, I guess we can test it. Maybe it does more damage. Maybe that's what you're talking about. Armored core pistol only? No, no, no. Armored core flamethrower only. Come on, man. Come on, man. It was right there. How'd you miss it? All right, so let's see. Normal attack damage, about 71. That one, about 98. And a death. Uh, no, that is not the bread and butter. <laughs> Chat, you have lied. Oh, boy. Hey, face robber. Thanks for popping in. Appreciate you. All right. Well, let's uh, let's just push through. Let's just push through. You know, I'm not a fan of ER, but do I enjoy the lore? I have not been able to find enough lore to enjoy. Like, I have, I've avoided spoiling myself with the game at all. So I don't actually, like, everyone's, like, talking about, like, Millennia and all sorts of, or, I don't know what her name is. Uh, like, all these bosses and proper nouns and things that are just, like, popping up. And I'm like, I don't know what any of this is. I don't know what anyone's talking about. So, yeah. No, I don't, I don't know what the lore is. I don't know anything past what I've seen. Which, again, might be half my battle. Gonna eat those later. Hello, goodbye. See you later. Whew. Ow. Is there a reason you're going down to fight BSB? Uh, because I don't want to grind 20k souls to go fight uh, Amelia? This just feels like the right way to go. Just feels like the right way to go. Leveling up, get some gems, that kind of thing, you know. All right. Elden Ring has lore the density of Game of Thrones and the obscurity of Dark Souls 1. That is... Yeah, that is not a good combo. Um, I've heard through the grapevine that most of the lore is in cut content. Is that correct? Because if so, that was a bad choice. There we go. Maybe I need a dose of Vadi, Vadi lore videos. Yeah, you know, I just don't want to. I don't like Vadi anymore. Not for anything he's done. I just don't. I just, I've just kind of moved on, you know. I'm sure he still makes great videos, but yeah, I don't know. You mean the one hand transform, two hand, two hand? Guess we'll find out. Let's see. One hand transform, two hand, two hand. That is super slow. I'd rather just do this. It does even more damage. I'm sure there's something I'm missing in that uh, advice you're trying to send, but it's getting garbled in the text. It's okay. Don't worry about it. We got it. We're fine. We're fine. We'll figure it out. It's fine. Oop. There you go. Oh, not all the way, I guess. Okay. All right. I'm just going to... I'm leaving. I'm walking away. No, I said I'm walking away. Get away from me. Where am I? What's happening? Did I go the wrong way? I went the wrong way again. Dang it. You cannot apply papers to the blood to the daggers, no. They cannot have any kind of buff on them. So empty fan phantasm shell or whatever. Ooh, that guy was glitching out. Uh, yeah, the empty phantasm shell doesn't work. Papers don't work. You, uh, all you got is your blades. That's it. Hello. Let's unlock a shortcut. So we don't keep getting shot at. Uh, nope. Too early. One more. There we go. That's better. All right. Do, do, do. Let's see, we can't get... Where's the door? Oh, there it is. Just past the giant werewolf, thanks. Yeah, we can't get these to plus five or plus six just yet. Um, we need to... Get 
do some new areas first. Whoa! I don't know what you drop, but I want it. All right, there we go. Oh, and oh, beast blood pellets. Oh, that was the piece I was missing, huh? Okay. Uh, I mean, I understand why that would be good. Yeah. I understand why that would be good, but I think, I think we'll be okay. I struggle to keep up aggressive. I struggle to keep aggressive in this game, which is kind of the whole thing of the beast blood pellet. So, all right, let's go, baby. Let's see how this is gonna go. I don't actually know. I have not equipped antidotes. Please hold. Uh, there they are. Oh god! Oh god! What's happening? Mm. All right. Don't think we can backstab you, so I won't even try. Damage is decent, better than we've had. Sad to say. Alright, we're gonna be fine. Come here, you. Come here. There we go. Quick little 200 damage there. Ooh, that yeah, that dodge attack does do like 100 damage. That's really solid. That's solid. We cover that. So that's what we gotta do. We gotta dodge in, stab, and if we're lucky, we can get in again. Hold on now. <laughs> now hold on a minute now. Yeah. That's bound to happen at least once. Okay. All's well. We're fine. Gotcha. How are we looking here? Pretty solid, pretty solid. Uh oh, uh oh, ooh, yep. I stood right in the wrong spot. Dang it. We were doing fine until we weren't. <laughs> uh, get, get the gas coin armor for the poison resistance. Oh, that's a good call. Yeah, we should do that. We should just get the gas coin armor to get the gas coin armor. If we're being honest. Does anyone like Rom? I mean, I like Rom. I think Rom is good uh, lore-wise and like just as like a oh shit kind of uh, moment. Considering that's the moment in the game where you suddenly realize like, alright, hold on. <laughs> this isn't just a vampire werewolf game. Hold on a minute. You know? Where are we going? Where are we? Hello. Give me the goodies. Thank you. And while we're here, I do have some more slots in this thing, I do believe. Oh, they're all... Like, okay, so here's what we gotta do. We gotta take that one off. Put it there. And then this one... None of these actually... <laughs> <laughs> do anything. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, no, whatever you do, the damage is not going to help. That's cool. Alright. Well, this one gives HP to recover, so you know what? Screw it. Until we can get some bigger gems, that's what we're stuck with. Alright. Uh, let's see. Put on the gas coin. Yes, for the slow, rapid poison defenses. Very good. Uh, where are we? Still at old yard. Okay. Rom's even better in the Chalice Dungeon. Well, let's not let's not get a <laughs> let's not get ahead of ourselves here. Not quite. Once the blades get going, it's basically business as usual. 
Here's hoping. Here's hoping. Yeah, the lore is awesome, but the fight is mid. Is a good way of putting that. For sure. Tonitrus only. Yeah, okay, have fun. You'll be rocking against all of the uh, alien bosses. You'll be doing fine there. Beasts, uh, the beasts are going to give you a hard time, though. Since they require fire damage and uh, usually anything serrated, which the Tantris is neither. <laughs> Vicar Romelia. <laughs> what? Oh, hello. Yeah, this is the right way. We're good. Trust yourself, Lemon. Trust yourself. We're fine. We're fine. Been wanting to do a boom hammer run for a while. I mean, go for it. Why not? The world is yours. Take it. You paid for it. <laughs> do what you gotta do. Mm -mm. All right, let's try this again. We had him the first time. I just, I just stood the wrong spot. What's my favorite boss in Bloodborne? That's a hard question. Um. Hmm. Now let's see what this extra 1% gem does. Nice, so good, wow. G18. Hi, welcome to the backlogs. <laughs> the back vlogs, what? The back vlogs, oh god, no. Can you imagine? Give me that health back. You stole it from me, it is mine. All right, about 70% done, not really, 30%. That's some backlogs math right there. I hope you guys are enjoying that. Um, yeah, no. Uh, best boss in Bloodborne. Hard for me to say. Mostly because I haven't really played through this game that much. I've probably beaten it maybe like six times. Oh, God, why? Okay, well, that seems like I was nowhere near that, but that's fine. That's yeah, fine. We should probably start dumping into health. Just a thought. Oh boy. Will we buy, will we spend something on the hunter's tools? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Martyr Lagarius? I do not like Martyr Lagarius, no. That is uh that is a big no from me. Lady Maria is fine. She's like the most Dark Souls boss in the game. Um so that's probably why I like fighting her. Orphan of Kaz sucks so hard. Not even not even close to being on this list. Um, Cleric Beast is fine. His camera sucks. Gas Coin is fine. His gun sucks. Uh, <laughs> Orphan of Kaz. I already said that one. I meant... Uh, what was the other guy? Uh, fucking... Uh, Space Potato is cool. Um, don't really like the spider... The little spiders and how hard they hit. Like, that kind of sucks. Uh... <laughs> Mikolash. Mikolash's uh, area of effect sucks. Um, now, and I know this sounds like super, <laughs> super negative. I'm just saying, like, that is the problem with the fight, and therefore uh, that takes it down a peg from me. Um, Abritas or Abrietas is fine. Amygdala is fine. Parl is fine. I don't know. Bloodborne, this guy here, he's okay I don't know I don't know if I actually like any of the bosses in this game <laughs> I think I think I like the game more than I like the bosses um, the uh, the ring wraiths are okay hmm I think the witches of Hemwick is pretty interesting it's an interesting fight could you again with the? Let me think of the DLC. Surely there's somebody in the DLC that I like that I don't. I actually do kind of like. Uh, is it the wig? Is that his name? I do kind of like Horsey Boy. For some reason, I'm not sure why, but I actually do like him. I think just because it's such a different fight. Like you're fighting a beast. The camera isn't that bad. He's not overwhelming the screen with like 
fluff everywhere like all the main game bosses do um and then you get to fight him with a sword later which is like all right cool yeah let's do it so yeah let's go with that let's go with that abby here's to a skill build yeah right please mercy <laughs> we need all the mercy we can get for sure Yeah, Ligarius, he's fine. I have trouble with his hitboxes. His hitboxes tend to just kind of slap me out of nowhere, and I'm like, okay. Not a huge fan of that. No, it's not down to Amelia or the witches. The witches are good. Amelia is too big and fluffy, and she takes up the entire screen, so I don't like her. Uh, yeah, I'm 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 a fan of uh, Ludwig or Horse Boy or whatever his name is. I can't remember something with an L. Lawrence, that is Lawrence, isn't it? I knew it was something like that. All right, Moon Presence. <laughs> Moon Presence is uh, Moon Presence has the pinwheel problem, where by the time you get to her, she just uh, kind of falls over like crumpled paper cool boss like cool gimmick and stuff like hey like turns your own health against you and all this stuff no one ever notices <laughs> because because she goes down so fast it's like oh wait what did she do ah whatever who cares come here you now we gotta play the get in get out game get in get out Step, step, run away. Step, run away. Gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Can you parry this boss? Can you parry all the bosses? I don't actually know. You gonna scream? Not screaming? You screaming? I can't tell. You're stuck. Nah, you're screaming. Okay. Oops, a little too close. Uh oh, uh oh. We're fine. Almost there. Don't you start. Fall over and die. Thank you. Woo! Easy. Ish. <laughs> that wasn't so bad. Alright, go. Cool. Move it on. All right, all right, all right. Have a good night, fish. See you later. Garmin broke lemon. Yeah, a little bit. You know, that might be half of the thing, is that I might have taken away some of my own fun with this game. Uh, with that run. That might have... That might have actually hurt me. In that case. I think it, I think the immolation run kind of did something similar with uh, with Dark Souls 2 because I keep trying to be like ah oh, I want to do a Dark Souls 2 run and then I pick it up and like I don't want to play <laughs> so I think it, there might be there might be something to that statement there yeah I might have broke it all right let's see we didn't get any new gems or anything like that we did get the chalice. Could do some chalice stuff for funsies. That might not be a bad play, considering we can get some actually decent blood gems there. That might be the play. Uh, no, we don't need a root chalice. Go ahead and put that there. Oh, I have any a thousand souls. Well, hold on a minute. I can get you that. Let's see. Take all these bullets. I don't need them. Let's see. We'll hold on to all this. I no longer need bloodstone shards. We are maxed out there. Go ahead and turn those in. And take this hunter axe too while you're at it. And this. And this. And this. And one of these. And one of these. And one of these. Save the rest. 
Hold on to everything else. And just like that, we got plenty of souls. Put this here. Might use that in a minute. Do some leveling. Come on, come on, come on. Alright. What is this max out at? Is it max out at 50? Is that right? I didn't forget to pump health. I just really want the damage. <laughs> we'll pump health next. Let's pop in here real quick. Let's see. You've done Queen Yarnum. You're done with the Chalice Dungeons. Yeah. I feel that. I, uh... I struggle to dive back into them, too. But, uh, this run is kind of hurting a little bit. So, something that gives us a little extra damage and a little extra health wouldn't be a bad problem. 40 skill? Are we sure? Are we sure? I feel like it's 50. Let me double check. Alright. Pop this one, too. You. Mm -mm -mm. 50 is a soft cap? See, that's what I thought. Yeah. 50 is just vitality? Alright, well, now we're getting mixed. Now we're getting mixed opinions here, guys. Oh, hello. You don't have that much health. Come here. Come here. You guys drop blood vials, thank God. Okay. If anything, this will be a good place to just kind of restock on supplies. Extra supplies, extra souls, the good stuff, you know how it goes. How's the run going so far? Ah, uh, well, we just killed the Bloodstar Beast. Um, so, I mean, that's that's pretty good. He didn't drop anything. That's pretty good. It's a good sign. Next is uh, Amelia, I would say, or the Witches. I'll probably go Witches, actually. That way we can start getting, like, runes. What's going on here? going on in here? There she, there she is. Ow. Get out of here and take your little minions with you. Thank you. Yeah, this place is good for souls. Like, just, I mean, we're already at, like, 2600, which is pretty cool. And none of the bosses or enemies are that hard. Ooh, he says. Getting fucking thwomped. <laughs> Getting just fucking smashed. Ow. Are we allowed to use the gun? No. Nope. If we were able to use the gun, this run would be easy. Alright. The cap is 50 for skill, but for some others it's 40. Yeah, Bloodborne seems pretty weird about what the, the caps are. It seems like um, it's 50 for skills, but it's 99 for arcane and 40 for health <laughs> it's all over <laughs> did we do a gun only run no but i am currently in the midst of a uh, bow only run um it's going a lot better than this run i'll tell you that much to the point where i have a, i have a sneaking suspicion that the bow is so good that we might just kind of it might be a non-run if i don't oh really seriously okay all right then you guys hit hard huh um, yeah, the bow only run is turning out to be pretty easy. Uh, and so I think what we'll end up doing is we'll clear the game and then we'll go into the chalice dungeons and beat the chalice dungeons. If it continues to be super easy and I, I just blow through the game, then that's what we'll do. That'll be our piece de resistance. But Lemon, we want to see the bow. Yeah, I know you're going to see the bow. But I'm already, like, halfway through that run, so I, I can't just pick it up and show it. You gotta, you gotta wait. You gotta wait. What are you doing? Stop hitting me with firebombs. That is my thing. Get your own. Okay. Let's try this again. We lost all of our souls. That's fine. I don't care. Ow. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah! Chalice Dungeons! I remember now. Oh, boy. Whew! There we go. Zelda bow only? Can't be done. Try as we might, it can't be done. 
The unfortunate thing about Zelda is that uh, more often than not, it requires that you play the game by its rules. Um, we will be doing a Majora's Mask run at some point in the near future, hopefully. I'm thinking in October. Um, but, uh, but yeah, we're gonna... There we go. That's, that was the play. That very adept dodge I just did there. Let's get rid of her, too. Hello. You like swords? Yeah, you like swords. Who are you? You like swords? Everyone likes swords. Yeah, so we'll probably do a Majora's Mask run of some kind in October, which I think will be a lot of fun. Uh, but it will not be bow only, I'll tell you that right now. Because <laughs> it's not possible. We're just gonna pull this. Maybe we don't have to come back here. There we go. That way if we get bonked again, it's okay. Take your lumps. See you later. <laughs> you wanna come down here and we wanna fight? Come on, let's fight. Here we go. God, what I would do to have a pistol right now. The horror I would bestow upon you and your people. Alright, good enough. Good enough, I'll take it. Breath of the Wild challenge run? No. Nope, haven't played Breath of the Wild. Cannot do challenge run. The one reborn is a nothing boss. Uh, yeah, he's pretty weird and dumb. Are we going to play another horror game in October? Yes, just one. <laughs> uh, yeah, probably. Um, I would like to probably play, like, the new Resident Evil. Uh, or the remake of 4. I think that'd be a good time. I think that would be a good time. All right, you. Oh, God. Wow, we did a lot of damage. What happened there? Did I just pop something on him, like, right away? Ooh, what's happening? Oh, shit, if they're all this easy, then we're gonna be fine. <laughs> Okay. Uh, that is an AoE, huh? Okay. You can just do that, huh? Oh, got greedy. Uh, I always miss time how much time I have between an attack and a dodge. How did I alien isolation go? Well, uh, whatever you saw on the whatever you saw on the stream was as far as I got. <laughs> That's as far as we got. I did not pick that game up again. I was like, mm -mm, nope, we're good. Mm -mm -mm. You never understood the chalices? Uh, there's not much to understand, for being honest. I mean, there's lore to it, but as far as uh, yeah, as far as like actual like why why did they do it? Uh, there's not that whole there's not that much to say. <laughs> Will we finish alien isolation? Really, dude? Just gonna just straight up just pounce on me like that? Yeah, just take it. Just take my life. I don't care. <laughs> I don't have any health pots. <laughs> oh no. Hmm. Go to the hammock charnel lane and upgrade your weapon and level up. Probably the way to play here. Yeah. We're tickling the giant. We're tickling everything. We are tickling everything. This weapon sucks. <laughs> I am not a fan. All right, let's 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 do that. Let's, let's head out of here. Clearly, this is not the right way to go. Um, let's head towards the witches and let's see what we can get from that. At least level up our weapon a bit. All righty. Let's see. So, uh, we've cleared old Yarnum. 
which means we can go to the Cathedral Ward. And then from there, a good time for you guys. Well, I'm glad. <laughs> I'm glad someone's enjoying themselves. Um, yeah, we're going to go here. We'll go through the little loop-de-loop, -loop and we'll go from there. Easy peasy. Blades of Mercy is equal to dual broken swords, essentially. Yeah, more or less. More or less. Yeah, I know we got no blood vials. I know. We're, we are officially blood vial poor. We're also soul poor, so there's literally nothing we've got going on right now. We just gotta kind of deal with it. Set this back down for later. Grandpa's got the Gatlin gun again. There he goes. At least we can sell all these bullets we're grabbing. That's something. Oh, yeah, we're also damage poor, you're right. Yeah. Yeah, not a lot going for this run. This run, uh... This run's got some issues. Not sure how to make it better. I mean, we could just add a pistol and we'd be fine. But, uh... Ow. But outside of that, not a lot... Not a lot we can do here. Stop shooting me, please. That is the opposite of what I asked. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. At least you can buff broken swords. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, you can't buff these. <laughs> They're good in the mid to late game. Well, that's uh, it's a little bit of a ways away, I think, huh? It's a little bit of a ways away. What's the most hated boss in any game you've played? Uh... If we're just talking about which which boss does everybody hate, probably the Bed of Chaos, if I had to guess. You know, there's a lot of really shitty bosses out there, don't get me wrong. But that one is just like... You, you've done insulted everybody with this. It would have been better if there had been no boss attached to it if you just went down and stabbed the bug. At least then it would have been like, oh, okay. Yeah, like We could have had like some lore or something with that. But no, you <laughs> it's just straight up a bad fight all the way around. So yeah. Where are you? Run away. There's my gun guy in there. Not you guys. It's you. You're my problem child. There we go. Are you, are you waving? What are you waving for? No. Stop. No. Stop. There we go. Okay. Oh, thank God. A blood vial. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. Blood-tinged gemstone. Interesting choice. Probably doesn't help me. Yeah, honestly, the big thing we need to do is we need to upgrade these. We need to upgrade the weapons. And in turn... We also need to uh, buff their damage with some actually good blood gems, um, which are going to be in low supply. Because the damage of this weapon is so low that uh, yeah, you really can't do much with the blood gems either. Let's go up here real quick. don't remember if there's something up here I need to grab or not. But yeah, because the look, but like I said, the damage is so low that like getting a 5%, 10% boost to the damage is like, great, five more damage. <laughs> Yay. My favorite. As opposed to any other weapon where it's like, okay, yeah, yeah, that boosted me up by like 30 or 50 or something like that. It's unfortunate. Why that flamethrower, old man? We will be we will be selling all these bullets though. That's we got that going for us. Oh hello, what are you doing? There's some twin bone shards here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're working on it. We're working on it. Grab that for no reason. The uh the werewolves everyone's talking about. Yeah, werewolves are good. I don't think they drop twin bones. I think they just drop the regulars. 
Um, they are a good source of souls for sure. However, you guys forget we don't have a pistol, so fighting them is kind of a pain in the ass. It's a little tricky. This doesn't feel like the right area. Where? Get you. Oop, well, there he goes. Oop, there he goes. I uh, do not have a gem. Ow. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we gotta basically just gotta keep pushing. That's really what it comes down to. Would I buy a Bloodborne remaster if it was on PC? If it was on PC, I would. Jail has a lot of twin shards. This is true. This is true. We should do that, maybe. That would be a good call. Let's... All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to initiate speedrun tactics mode. No more murdering people. Let's just, just go. We've got a few loose souls in our pocket. So that's good. So run through here. We're going to grab as many twin shards as we can find. We'll go to jail. That guy actually had like 3,000 souls rolling around in his body right there. Hold on a minute. I don't know why he has my souls, but I'm not going to complain. You give me those back. That'd be appreciated. Thank you. All right. That's when they run this way. Okay, this guy here. There's some of them to start. Work our way down. And keep moving. Best tactic in Souls games, just run. No kidding. Oh, this might be tricky. I might not be able to go this way because I have no health. Yep, that's not going to work. All right. New plan. Go to jail. <laughs> okay. Twisted Mind rejoining us for seven months. Thank you so much. All right. Mercy Blade is the one you get from Crow Girl, yes. Mm hmm. All right. Uh, let's see here. Let me go spend these souls real quick. We'll go buy some health pots. And then we will uh, go to jail and get the rest of the things there. That'll be good. Hello. A whopping eight. Thank you so much. Nothing but the finest. All right. Move along. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Don't forget to go there later for decent gems and lots of souls. Go where later? Go where? Mm-mm-mm. Oh, let's get a sippy break in here, huh? We need it. We've earned it. Uh, gotta sip that speed juice. Why well, Blade of Mercy out of all the weapons? Uh, because it's the closest to dual daggers. Um, no other reason. <laughs> Alright, so let's get rid of you so you don't actually kill me. Is the bag man here? Yes, he is. Hello. I want that item you're hiding over there. Let me just... Yeah, okay, cool. Thanks. There, I wanted that. Alright, do your worst. Go ahead. Eh. <laughs> there we go. Alright. That'll work. Good. This game taught you how to be better at Dark Souls 1. Same. For sure. Where are we up to? We are collecting uh, shards for a plus 6 weapon. That's where we're at. Mm -mm -mm. All righty. Okay, I think we've gotten the point there. We can move on. All right, let's go. You guys just threw me in a cell that didn't even have a lock on it, huh? Okay. Can't find good help these days, I guess. Grab this, though. Go down the way. 
Grab ourselves a priest lady. Hello. I'm here to save you. Good luck, have fun. All right. So that, always good to have on hand. The bagman grind? No, 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 no. We're not we're not grinding bagman. We only have one weapon that needs to upgrade and there should be, if memory serves, um, enough twin shards around the map that we should just be able to just do it. So I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's the case. Oop, hello. No, no, not now. I'm here for this. You can just stay over there. All right, bye. <laughs> What's the death count so far? I'm afraid to ask. We definitely want this. That'll help her later. And now we run. And now we run. Probably die a few times. It's all according to plan. Please no. Okay. It's a very long attack animation. It's a shame Eileen had to die. It is. Yeah. Ooh, easy. Easy. And there's one. Is that really all there is down here? Oof. Okay. Well, open the shortcut. Hello. Whoa. Some blood vials. Hey. No complaints there. Some bullets, aka money. Yay. Come with the smacking. All right. I don't think there's anything else down here for us. So we should get out of here. That guy just laying down having a day. Alright. Back up. There's some more on the other side. We'll get those. Hey, Tom, how's the wife? Whoa. Nope. Are the blades good? No. No, the blades are terrible. They are actively bad. Simon's bow blade is great. That challenge run's going fine. This one, though. Ooh, baby. This one is struggling to get off the ground. Who's yelling? Oh, it's the pig. Well, hey, if the pig is out already... Oh, wait, that's a different pig. Uh-oh. Huh. I don't think there's actually souls or things down here. Nope, that's garbage. Great. Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> that is an angry pig, holy shit. <laughs> Goddamn. Okay, well, that happened. Are we going after Parl? No. No. Parl would just fucking decimate us, man. Diablo 3 challenge run. What, play the game? Is that the challenge? I do have a Diablo 2 challenge run that I finished... I th well, I'm, I think I'm as far as I want to get in that run. Um, I need to edit it down, but it is done. So, if you want Diablo stuff, I do have something coming in the pipes. Just gotta give me some time. Can you play Diablo 4 without wanting to die? No, you cannot. That game sucks, man. Don't you run away from me. Don't you run. Yeah, I will not be touching Diablo 4 again. There we go. There's a good number there. That'll get us to plus 5, I think. They got some heavy fixing to do. And honestly, um, even then, like, I don't know. Like, I want a Paladin class. I don't like any of the classes that they do have. They fucked the Sorcerer up so bad that making a Fire Sorcerer just doesn't feel right. It's just, it's, it's gross. Is Diablo 4 bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. It's pretty freaking bad, man. Have I played Remnant 2 yet? I did a whole review on Remnant 2. Or first impression, I suppose. Um, yeah, no, I did a whole video on it. It's good. It's it's a solid game. Um, personally, I felt, in my own opinion, it felt like just more of Remnant 1. Uh... I just didn't think they did a whole lot different with it. But at the same time, though, um, D3 
the argument could be made of, you know, don't fix what's not broken, which I said as much in the in the impression. I was like, look, if you're if you're okay with it being more of uh, the first game, you're gonna love it. You should play it. Um, there's nothing wrong with it. It's not broken. It's not bad. It's just uh, if you want something different, well, then you know. All right. I think that's all we've got there. Ain't no fixing what Diablo 4 is. Yeah, yeah, Blizzard games, man, they're just not, they're just not. I think that's really all you can, <laughs> that's all you need to say. All right. Did I farm the 40k blood echoes from the blood for the messengers? Yeah. Yep, I did that. It was, it was fun. Mmm, we can only level it up once with what we got right now. Okay, so we need to explore a bit more. I actually have some vials now, though. So if we... Oh, not old Yarnum. Where am I going? No. So now we can hop down into that little section there, which kind of leads back to... Up and around. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Ah! <laughs> When I do play uh, Baldur's Gate 3, what kind of build will we go with? I don't know, actually. Um, kind of depends on how the game plays. I actually don't know much about it. Um, if it's similar to 1 and 2, where you have like an entire party that you need to control, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know enough about the game to say. I'll probably try some like to make a party that I've uh that I usually have in D&D &D. so you know I'll just kind of get the basic mix but we'll see we'll see Paladin is super fun to run in uh, BG3 well yeah because Paladin is super fun in 5e so you know all right the forest has some uh it should yeah yeah it certainly should, but we got to kind of work our way around to it. Um, so we can either grind 20,000 souls, which I really don't want to do, or we can go the way I'm about to go. And go that way. We Take the little back road entrance, if you will. Get out of my way. See ya. Uh, this way. Is there any items in the game that will help us stun enemies? There is, like, the Beast Roar. That might be something worth looking into. Um, it'll at least knock them off balance so I can kind of wail on them a little bit. But I don't know. I do not know. Oh, you? Okay. Good. Down again. Good. Here we go. Let's go get some stuff. Let's go get some stuff. First things first. We need to make a stop out here. For a free 40,000-ish souls. There we go. Sell those later. Um, He got the doll. <laughs> yeah. Grab that for later. Click this. Grab this thing. And grab the bone. Right. All good here. Moving right along. Yeah, old hunter's bone. I've never actually used it. Um, or I haven't used it well. I understand it like just makes your dodge better, question mark. Um which could be very helpful in this run, so I think my main issue with it was that it was such a short time period, though. It was like, what, like 10 seconds or some shit? Which is like, at that point, I might as well not bother because I'm just spending more time re-upping it than I am using it. Ow. Why so hard? There you go. Sit down. There we go. All right. Why not do a doll cosplay? Uh, because the doll armor is bad. It's very, very bad. It decreases the recovery of the dodge. Oh, I mean, that's good. But like, like I said, I think the timing 
the amount of time. Whoa, Jesus. Uh, that it gives you for that is not great. Maybe I'm misremembering it, but it's also super expensive. Well, I mean, we're not really we're not really using ammo, so it's not super expensive for us. Uh, apparently, it requires 15 arcane to use, though, so that's a slight hindrance, huh? That's a slight problem. All right. Oh, you meant the doll set. Yeah, yeah, we'll be selling that. We'll be taking our 40,000 souls and calling it a day. But first, let's wiggle worm our way. So we've opened the door there, which is good. What's this? Money. Money good. Open this. And let's make our way to the forest. Ooh, mind yourself. Ooh, mind yourself. Yeah, because I don't feel like taking on the vicar is a good idea right now. But he says it lasts 16 seconds. Yeah, that's like, ugh. Why'd you do that? <laughs> Come on, FromSoft. 16 seconds, really? Six of those seconds are using the damn thing. What are you doing? Can you do a charge R2 for backstabs? Uh, not when it's transformed, no. Nope, you gotta switch it over. Okay. So we just gotta sprint through this little section here. Please no, please no. Friendly, friendly. Leave it. Drop it. Good. Uh-oh. No touchy. Okay. Made it. I'm alive. <laughs> About not to be. <laughs> oh boy. Click. <laughs> Alright. We made it. Now we can die. It's okay. Ooh. Or live. That works too. That went better than expected. That is not an item. That is an actual lantern. Okay. Do we push forward? No. Yes? No? What did I just pick up that I... Oh, right. Selling souls and stuff. No, let's do that. Ah, right, let's go. Woo! Am I running past enemies? Sure am, buddy. This, uh, this weapon is no bueno. So, uh, the less enemies I have to fight with it, the better. All right. Sell all the bullets. Good. Oh, I bought them. I didn't sell them. Oops. Oh. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Okay. Well, shit. Sell the pebbles, I guess. Hold on to those. Sell those. Uh, does it sell these for the actual price? It does not. No, do not sell those. Uh-uh. Um, uh, cool. Keep the twins. Sell the shield. That's obviously not useful for us. Okay. Let's see. Oh, right, right, right. The armor. Gotta sell the armor. Silly me. Um, uh, boop, 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 boop. Style skirt for 7k, gloves for 7k, clothes for 14, that for 7. Fair price. You run a hard bargain there, guys. Welcome. Okay. Very welcome. Alright, so we said it was 50 for skill. What's our damage difference here? 6. Honestly, I would rather have the health right about now. What's that put me up? Like, easily over 150 health? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Okay. And it looked like I actually could almost get another level, so let's go ahead and pop one of these. Welcome. That should be enough. Very well. What's our vitality yet? A little bit more, never hurt anything. Let's do it. Okay. Here, have a small ornament. Thanks. And I'll take that. Smashy. Okay. Not actually useful for us, but fun to have. Okay. Moving on, let's see here. Uh, we unlocked the forest. There it is. Let's go. 
That should help. That should help. Can you beat Baldur's Gate 1 and 2 with only fire damage? That is tricky. Those games are hard, man. <laughs> I've been trying to play through with just a single character, and that that alone has been rough, so... <laughs> Lemon investing in vitality. Is the, are the blades that bad? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. This was the weapon you used for the rest of the game the moment you got them. Good memories. Really? Well, all right. You are a better player than I. I don't think that's saying much at this point, but still. All right. So the blades aren't too bad here. They're working. They're doing work. I can work with this. Uh, let's uh, zip on through. Hey now, where are you going? Ooh, that's a nice little combo. Hold on a minute. You can shorten the R2. If you kind of give it the old one, ow, one, two. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Well, it felt fun. Okay. What's the transform blade of mercy? Uh, it's either dual daggers or a short sword, essentially. Oh, missed, really? All right. All right. Okay. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Thanks. That's fine. Whatever. Hey, Subfuture, thank you so much. Appreciate ya. Mm -mm -mm. Use the L2 to avoid and transformation attack after a charge. After a charge? So like a... Let's see. Uh, you. Eh. It's such a slow attack is my only concern. It doesn't do that much more damage than just a regular R1. Like if I just do the dodge R1, it actually does better damage that way. Yeah. Yep. I think, uh, I hate to say it, but uh, the Blades of Mercy just aren't that good in the, in the early stages. You gotta really pump into them. It's just the way it goes one of those things where it's like it is a late game weapon oh nice i don't have to kill anybody for these good uh it is a late game weapon so the game expects you to be able to upgrade them right up to like high levels immediately um so because we aren't able to do that a lot of people have a misconception about how good the weapon is right now there we go that might boost us to plus five i think easy there buddy Easy. I'm just walking through. Nobody mind me. Don't mind me. Just unlocking shortcuts. All is good. Alright. Send that down. Okay. Well, now I have to steal that health back from you. Go. Zip, sub, zoop. Nope. Ow. <laughs> okay. Now there is... I think just a gem over here or something. There's something over here. Including you. I remember you. That guy. It's a uh, garbage. Okay, cool. Ah, oh, that'll work. That's better. <laughs> okay. Garbage. Wait, there was a. I swear there was a, th a warpy boy in here, but apparently not. Maybe I missed it. Would you settle down now? What are you doing? What are you doing? Give me that. Get out of here. Fucking run, fucking run. Oh, yeah. 
Nope. Uh-uh. Leave me alone. Ah. <laughs> so many angry people behind me. Okay. So far, so good. Shortcut, 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 shortcut. All right. We got it. Speed on complete. Take that. That's just money. That's just money at this point. Uh, which way do I go? Is it this way? No. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, jeez. All right. You know, maybe dying might be the best play here. I don't know. Well, I didn't really have a choice. Cool. All right. <laughs> there we go. What about a Fist of Grasha run? Uh, yeah, no. If you think I'm struggling with a with actual blades, why would <laughs> why would punching things to death do any better? Uh, it's only useful for the stun. Yeah, if it could parry, right? If it could parry, I would absolutely use it. Um, just because then I'd be parrying and punching things to death with my fist. It would just be fist on fist action. It'd be so good. Uh, however, though, it only stuns. And so you're just kind of just getting walloped by everything. There's just nothing There's nothing good from that. The damage is really terrible. It's just, I don't think it's valid. You're so angry you couldn't parry? I know. Yeah, such a, such a missed opportunity. Could have been so cool. Woo. All right, you're still smacking me around. That's fine. Did the other guy steal my souls? I bet he did. Got some glowy eyes back there. Mm, hard to say. But my souls aren't up here. So somebody stole them. Cool. Cool. Hey, what are you hiding over here? Mind if I take it? Thanks. Oh, you're doing great, man. Keep it up. All right. We got an actual triangle gem. That's good. Wiggle. All right. You know what? All right. You know what? You, oh my god. That's cool. <laughs> That's fine. Whatever. All right. We need to zip past them, but I can't leave the ladies alive because they'll bunch up and kill me while I'm trying to get the beastie who has my gems. I keep calling them gems. My upgrade materials. I don't know. I don't know. It's going to be a little tricky. The fists are actually semi-decent. The fists are amazing um, if you parry or repost. Or rather, if you're reposting or if you're backstabbing. Um, they have the fastest charge time, I think, of any weapon. So, you spend the least amount of time trying to... Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, you spend the least amount of time trying to charge up that R2, which is helpful. Uh, and they also level incredibly with, I think, skill and strength? Or if it, maybe it's just skill. I'm not quite sure. It's one of the two. All right. Zenobia, love the contents. Your favorite background noise while you paint your Warhammer minis. Oh, nice. Yeah, I can see it being real good for that, for sure. Do a Hadouken only run. I don't know if the Hadouken is actually any good, like damage wise. Uh, and with anything in Dark Souls 2, you really gotta consider it before you start it because. Uh, the DLCs are absolutely a thing. And the last thing you want to do is spend 50 hours playing through the main game just to realize that you can't even make an inch in the DLCs. It's just like, ugh. So, maybe. I don't know. I've never used it before, so it'd be kind of interesting to play around with at least. All right. Come here. Hello. There we go. That's better, much better. Let's go. Where are you? You're in here somewhere. Where are you? There you are. Gotcha. Here's another two. What are we sitting at? A 
We are at 10. And this weapon is a plus 3. So that'll get us... That's 3 and 5. So that'll get us the plus 5. That's good. Still need a few more, but uh, one step at a time. Oops, we came in here with insight. Oops, it'll. That'll nah, be all right. If we do some backstabbing here, I think we'll be a okay. Can I get a second one? No. Ah, almost half the damage or half our health bar already though, so that's good. So that's good. That's where that skill's all going. All that skill damage. Ooh, hello. Alright, you're just gonna be that guy, huh? Alright, come here then. You don't have any poise. <laughs> I'll, I'll rip you to shreds, I don't care. Alright, where'd she go? Where'd she go? I thought that was a summon. I didn't realize that was her. Oh. Oopsies. There you go. Woo! Nice try, nice try. Yeah. Nope. Well, we get to play Ring Around the Rosie again. There you are. Oh, is this the second witch? Yeah, it's the second witch. Okay. Alright, that's fine. So that witch is probably down to about half health, which is good. Where's the other one? Probably lurking around up here. No. Where'd you go? There you are. That's fine and dandy, okay. This is gonna be fine until it's not. I have a feeling something weird's gonna happen in like the second phase. Although if we keep wailing on them like this, maybe we won't even need it. Maybe they'll maybe she'll die before we get that far. Oh god, get away from me. Yeah, she's dead already. Okay, interesting. Not sure how that's gonna work out. Uh where is she? There's someone in quite a few now. Just need the second one who's hiding. There you are. Die, 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 please. Oh, God. Are you kidding me? Okay. What is this magic pixel bullshit? <laughs> Get away from me. Where is she? Where is she? There you are. There, just go away. <laughs> just go away. <laughs> Jeez. Uh. Bout, joining us for three months. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Alrighty. Well, that was a thing. Moving on. Take that. That'll help out a bit. And then uh, let's just get the hell out of here. Woo! Now get back to the Chalice Dungeons. Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> Oh, okay. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that was silly. I don't know why I did that. Whatever. How far in are we? Um, well, we're... I guess as far as the main game is considered, we're about to fight Amelia. So, there's that. Alright. Fortify. Fortify. Very good. We need about six more, which kind of sucks. Let's see here. This guy. That's a healthy boost. We'll take that. Yeah. Adds a slow poison effect. Ooh. Uh, let's see. Any of this help us at all? Uh, this one's better, actually. Yeah. All right. Progress. We're making progress. 
And then we'll take the moon rune for extra souls. Extra souls are always welcome. Shotokan, karate enthusiast. <laughs> That's a name. Welcome. Thank you so much for joining us. Very welcome. welcome to the academy. All right. So I think we're good on health again. I think we're doing okay there. We can continue to pump our skill. What do I need? 66? Hold on. Give me a minute. I'll sell some bullets. Sell items. Don't buy them. There we go. Uh, sell them too. Whatever. Can't use them. Can't use them. Is that enough? I feel like that's not quite enough. I'll pop one of these two. There we go. Okay. 30 skill. 30 skill is pretty good. 20 off of the main, the full thing, but, you know, it's a start. It's a start. All right, so we could go Chalice Dungeons, or we could try Amelia. I'm going to try Amelia real quick. Cathedral Ward is the fastest way there. Um, we'll see how that goes. Hopefully well. Going to be heading to a new longsword school. Nice. Is that for karate? <laughs> is, is that a... Are they teaching longswords and karate now? Back when I did it, I remember, like, you had the choice of learning how to use, like, a katana. I went with the... Uh, I can't remember if it was bow or Joe. I forget which one's which. Uh, the bow or Joe staff. I went with a short staff. That was, that was my weapon of choice uh, to learn. Because uh, the way I figured was, if I am going to use karate in real life, in a real life scenario, I should say, um, the likelihood of me having a sword on hand is not very high, but the likelihood of me being able to pick up a stick and use it is pretty up there. So, if I can, if I can learn how to whip around a stick real good, then that'll, that'll work. That'll serve. That's the bow. Thank you, Challenger Andy. Appreciate you, buddy. Yeah, the one that's like four feet long instead of like six. They teach karate, but you're learning German longsword. Oh. German longsword? What's that? I'm familiar with the Scottish Claymore. <laughs> the sword. The Bojo Staff. Yeah, it's one of those. <laughs> Yeah. Bo is the long staff. Joe is the short one. All right. Whatever. Whichever one is which. The short staff. Yeah. Uh, Lem the sword master too? No, no, no. I don't, I don't know how to use the sword. I looked at it and like I said, this is cool and all, but no. The Zwei. The Scottish Claymore is actually longer than a Zwei. The Scottish Claymore was designed to cut down horses. It was uh, specifically designed to um, fight against all of the horsemen that kept killing all of the Scottish armies. Uh, so like, fine, you want to come at us with horses all the time? <laughs> we got a sword for that. It was a thing. Volume warning? Yeah, for sure. Christmas time is here. Filling me with beer. Uh, all right. Hello. All right. Let's see what we're looking with. Well, it's not terrible. It's not good. I'm gonna, this could be another don't lock on fight, isn't it? Yeah, you, I forgot how much she screams. <laughs> There she goes. Ooh, 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 please. Oh, you bitch. All right. Oh, round two. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, we need to take advantage of that whenever we can because our skill is high. It's not often I get to take advantage of actually slamming on headshots. Wow. Just crumpling. Crumpling like paper. But her being in that corner is not a good time, though. Fill up, because I have a weird feeling. She's healing. Or rather, healing.
healing her limbs, I should say, not her health. Easy, easy. Come on. Take a greedy lemon. Take a greedy. That would have been a problem to be in. Seriously. <laughs> you and your goddamn magic pixels this game, I swear. Get out of here. Thank you. First try. All right, let's go. Whoo. That damage is so good. What do you mean? <laughs> Tell me you're a challenge runner without telling me you're a challenge runner. Oh, God. All right. That's something. Touch the thing. That's good enough. No one cares about the lore. Skip, skip, skip. All right, we made it. Spend the souls before I lose them. Whew, all right. The damage is finally catching up. This is better. This is better. It was... <laughs> doing 20 damage in the beginning of the run was slowly killing me, so this is, this is nice. I'm okay with this. Please take these souls away from me. I cannot be trusted. There we go. 32. It's not much, but it's 11. More health, because I need health. Uh, get rid of the bullets. Turn them into health. One single thing. <laughs> I'll give you 20 bullets for one health pot. Jeez. Okay, where are we going now? Um, where are we going now? We need to go... Oh, the password. How do you get there? I always forget. I feel like it's... I feel like if we take the Grand Cathedral, maybe we can get there faster. Hmm. All right, yeah, Chad, I might be needing your help in a little bit. Nick, first rule, always hit them more. <laughs> yeah, very true. Very true. If they look dead, hit them again. Right out of the cathedral. Hmm. Down the stairs from the Grand Cathedral. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll we'll get there. I trust I trust Andy on this one. You got to take a left. It's right if you're approaching the cathedral, left if you're exiting. Alright, so we go this way. We run this way. Is this correct? Actually, you know, I don't know. This might be wrong. Andy, this is wrong, buddy. This isn't right. There's some stuff down there, but nothing I need. Yeah, no, that's not right. That's not right at all. Not that kind of left, though. Excuse me. <laughs> well, pardon me. Uh, all right. Is Andy gaslighting again? He might. He very well might be. He very well might be. Okay. Let's see. This way leads to the. This way leads to the witches again. That's not the way to go either. I always get turned around at this part in the game. I always get turned around here. I want the giant court... Ow. I want the giant courtyard. Oh, there it is. is it, it's just right down there? Oh. Yeah, no, I know where I'm going now. Okay. This should all just be madness. Yeah, so we don't need to pick that up right now. We don't need that right now. We can go this way. I don't think this is quite right, but that's okay. Things are spawning in. That's kind of weird those for no reason. Thanks. Oh, no. This is the right way. Okay, we're good. Hey, Sol hey Solaire. How's it going? See you later. Bye. Grab his stuff. Grab his stuff. Run. Speed run, baby! <laughs> Slow render. I know. Not a good sign. The PS4 might be dying. I don't know. Already did. Wee. Okay. Forbidden Woods. Good, good. Heal. Good. 
All right, so now there should be a couple blood gems here we can kind of use, which would be nice. The rest of our twin shards, there's one, are here as well, so that's good. No touchy. Ow. That's not what I said. That's the opposite of what I said. Stop touching me. Oh, that's right. You have a friend. Who told you you could have friends? There we go. That's better. Pebble. Blood vials. Good to go. You have plenty of experience with the Yado and Kenjitsu, particularly Muso Shiden Ryu and Nami Ryu, respectively, but the Master Hand German Longsword feels very different from Kenjitsu. I imagine it would. What level of rank are you over there? I know that's kind of subjective sometimes, and it depends on the... Depends on the dojo, but... Just curious. See ya. See ya, loser! Okay. I don't think either of those are actually helpful, but that's fine. You never know. Maybe make the weapon do poison damage? Technically, it already does, but, uh... No, poison in Bloodborne is bad. Poison is a trap. You love on the wiki when the map for this place was replaced with a circle that simply said snakes. <laughs> was that a thing? That's awesome. <laughs> That's really good. Someone deserves a medal for that. <laughs> oh, God. See you later, Bardic. Have a good one. Get out of here. Get out of here. Damn, okay, we got some... We got some heavy soul grab here. I like that. That's good. If I actually take the time to murder anybody here, we'll be getting some heavy souls. Uh, we want to go this way. I think I remember how to breeze through this area. Take your lumps. Give me the vials. Yeah, that moon runes are already putting in work. That's good. That's good. Skip all these bozos. I think there's something we want down here. I don't quite remember. You. Yes, you. That's what I wanted. Perfect. Get out of here. Finally. Oh, man. It feels good to be doing actual damage. Good lord. Do the bonk hammer next? The hammer's bad. It was my first weapon, my first playthrough. And it was... Whoo! Whoo, baby. A lot of things in this game. Uh, dual, uh, Serrated damage is king. Truly it is. And, uh... Surprisingly, the hammer does not have serrated damage, so who'd have thought? All right, should I unlock all this? I feel like I should unlock all this. Actually, there's the arcane thing here, too. We should definitely do that. Is an arcane gem around here somewhere? Run, run in the sun. All right, there we go. There's something here. A lot of people being upset about the Kirk hammer, huh? <laughs> it's too slow for me. That's my issue. It, you know, you know me. If it's if it does a lot of damage, that's great. But I need speed. I need my speed. If you can't give me that, I can't use your weapon. It just doesn't work. A lot of triangle gems here. That's good. Where are my antidotes? Where are my antidotes? Hello, they're there. Right at the top, of course. There. Why wouldn't they be? Uh, where is the little hidey hole? This looks about right. Snakes! <laughs> Worms? I don't know there. Oh, my weapon can actually hit them for once. That's amazing. Okay, alright. Let's 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 all calm down. Hold on. <laughs> let's take a minute, shall we? Alright. There we go. That's better. Hmm. Now then, Arcane. I think that's going to be good for us. I don't know for sure. Time will tell. All right, that's about all the good things down here. Where is the exit? Is this it? Yeah, this looks right. A little bit of this, a little bit of this. There we go. All right. 
Shortcut. Let's go. How do we get the weapon without attacking anything? I mean, we technically slapped Eileen. So, I mean, I had to do, like, two damage. But, uh... Yeah, then we just kind of let her uh, throw herself off a couple cliffs, and that was all it took. And then we had to sit and grind on the bridge, which was fun. So, yeah. But then you can get it. <laughs> Sam, I'm glad I was an inspiration, but you can't blame me for that. <laughs> You're allowed to stop at any time, man. You're allowed to stop. That's the beauty of it. I can't stop. Not anymore. I've th That choice has been taken away from me. But for you all, there's still a hope. Get away from Gooey McOoey down there. No thank you. What is their deal with uh, poison swamps? I don't know. They just like them. We don't question the madness, we just accept that it's there. Oh, I'll let these birds live. It's fine. Sam, come to Brazil. Ah, uh, unfortunately, that's kind of out of the budget right now, but I wish I could. I don't think I... I haven't been to South America just yet. I think that'd be fun. I would like to see. Lemon wouldn't stop even if he could. Yeah, you don't know me. <laughs> <laughs> I've been enjoying some Power Wash Simulator. Thank you very much. Although I did find a way to I did find a way to challenge run it, so that's um yeah, that's a thing. Anyway, uh, anywho, let's move on. Let's move on. Miyazaki just likes to watch us suffer. That is true. He is a big fan of the suffering. Yeah. You have to use Morse code to move. Yeah, okay. SOS. Just, just slapping SOS as hard as I can. <laughs> That's how I win. Oh, God. Power Wash Simulator Firebombs only. God, I wish. Unfortunately, no. Alright. There we go. Resonance. You like to believe that Miyazaki puts in poison swamps and the devs have to rush to remove them from the game hours before release. That's the challenge. That is their own personal challenge, yeah. There's actually 50 poison swamps in every game. We're lucky we only get one at the end. Uh, let's let's get that level. I want that level. Here, take this. There we go. <laughs> Come to Washington State. I have not been to Washington State either, I don't think. I've been to Oregon, which is very close. So I know the vibe, but I haven't been to Washington itself. Did not have time. All right. I've been around the United States pretty, f pretty fluently. I've been to most states, I'd say, uh, but I haven't been to all of them just yet. Where am I going? Let's see. We are trying to... I need the forest. That's what I need. Not those. Those are bad. Actually, wait, do I have... No, I only have six. Damn. Back to the woods. What's a possible challenge in Power Washing Challenge Run look like? Uh, so you know how there's ladders and step stools and uh, the fucking rampart things? What if there weren't? <laughs> what if there weren't? Can you beat the game? Time will tell. Yeah, I'm doing that, and I have another little twist I'm throwing on it as well. So because because I have an addiction to that game, and I am trying to find any way to play it more than I should. And I know I recognized that I was uh, it was stopping me from editing videos because I would edit a video for like 30 minutes and then be like, I deserve a break, and then play that game for an hour, and I'd be like, Oh God, no! I that is the opposite of how that was supposed to go. Uh, so yeah, so I figured, you know what? Fuck it. If I'm gonna, if I'm gonna constantly distract myself with this game, I might as well make a video out of it, and therefore, <laughs> at least get some of my time back. So, yeah, it'll be a whole thing. All right, let's get moving. 
Where is the exit? I think it's this way. Yep, yeah, this looks right. Into the firebomb swamp here. The water that is actually oil. There we go. Let them murder things. There's one more. Sh I need one more. Oh! Well, there it is. That's our eighth shard. We're good on the twin blood. Nice. Okay, shortcut has been unlocked over here. Power Watch DLC stream when? I already completed it. I don't... I'm, I'm officially out of content in that game, I think. Oh, there's one more just for good measure. Oh, there's three. Okay, well. Cool. Uh, yeah. Yeah, if I, if I do it casually for some reason, just for more... Um, just to feed my addiction, it'll be on the second channel, so... Just, uh, keep an eye there. If you need more power washer in your life. Okay. So far, so good. Eh, stuck. Wait, okay. For some reason, I thought that was an empty pit. It was not. That was an unnecessary heart attack. We're fine. Oh yeah, there's a Back to the Future one coming. Yep. Yep. We'll uh, we'll get there when we get there. Please no. Okay. Let's see. Shortcut. Shortcut. All right. There we go. Some antidotes, cause why not? I have plenty of souls. Oh god, the bird. Uh, let's go upgrade our thing to plus six, and then we can go kill the katana boys. Ugh, and that'll be good. Ah, that's better. All right. Pop in here. Fortify this. That gives us another blood gem. We also got a couple other things here. Ooh, much better. Yes, please. Um, 72, 73, 83. Good. And all these are surprisingly worse. Uh, that one does better for the thrust. Is it safe to say that the thrust is my, R, my dodge R1? I think it is. So, yeah, that's good. We can boost that a bit. Awesome. And I also have more slots now. Uh, that's moon. Let's increase our blood vials, even though I'll never have that many. That's fine. Okay. And I should have enough souls lying around here somewhere. Get at least one more level. Welcome. Najiri Cat, welcome. Thank you so much. Uh, ooh, just short. Okay, hold on a minute. Hold that thought. There we go. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, Very good. Well. And you gifted a scholarship to somebody as well. Very kind of you. Very kind of you. Talk about coming in and stirring up the stirring the pot. Well done. All right. Ooh, let's uh, let's play some Lord of the Rings. Let's do it. And <laughs> Nito got it. <laughs> nice. That was the wrong response, Nito. The correct answer was, oh, Nito. <laughs> All right. I'm so sorry. Moving on. Boosting thrust should also boost your viscerals. Really? Interesting. Visceral is thrust? Ooh, that's good to know. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, 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 okay. And the Karate Enthusiast is also blessing somebody with a scholarship. Thank you so much. <laughs> Appropriately, it goes to Ninja Man. Wow, that's... <laughs> you can't make that shit up. Okay. Cool. That's funny. You just allowed gifts? Well, they... And now you know why. I don't know why you wouldn't, you know? I don't think there's any downside to it. It's literally just like, hey, do you want the potential for a free membership? Uh... 
you don't get charged and you get stuff with it sometimes if you get lucky. Just do it. All right. Well, we don't need anything here. There's nothing here for us. So we're going to take the shortcut. Which is, follow me, you go right down the main path until you see this lantern right here that kind of looks like an arrow sticking out of the tree. You take a short right, then back down. And then you would just follow right between those two trees that would take you right down to the shortcut. But, unfortunately, I need to go unlock the shortcut, so we'll be right back. Just gotta open that door real quick. And then we're golden. That's not a door, that's a giant snake. Ow! Okay. Ooh, it's a snake. Well, this isn't right. Well, this doesn't look right at all. No touchy. Thank you. Alright. What's the name of the second channel? Shortcut Unlocked. And that's the one. Yeah. That's where I do... Ran I, I used to do, like, reviews and things of games over there. I haven't done it in a long time. Uh, because that has kind of transformed into We Need to Talk. Uh, which I'm very grateful for. So basically, if I'm ever trying any kind of new content that I'm not sure how well it'll do or how the audience will respond to, um, I put it there first as, like, a test. Um, it's also where I do a lot of casual streaming, so very often I'll be like, eh, I want to try something, and it might be research for a challenge run, but more often than not, it's just me playing a game I haven't played before and actually getting into my backlogs. So, clockwise metamorphosis. I think that's either health or stamina. I don't remember which. One of the two. All right. You quite enjoy the need to talk ones? I'm glad. Yeah. Yeah, I've been enjoying them too. I've got one in the works for... The next one that I've decided on is going to be for Blasphemous 1. Uh, just because the last time I played that, I did not do it justice. And that was like two years ago. So I feel like I didn't get my point across very well. Yeah, that's decent damage. We like that damage. You know what? Come here. Oh, <laughs> no, completely missed. I need to get rid of Katana Boy. He's my problem. He is my problem, child. Can I... Oh, I did not realize how quickly my health just melted there. Okay. Damn. Uh, the health is uh, the damage is not bad. We'll be fine. I was a little worried the damage is going to be fine. <laughs> Spearhead, you got it correct there, buddy. Yeah. You got it correct. Yeah, I got a little wombo combo there. We'll get it. We'll get it. We just got to pick our target first. I'm it's either we should either go for the mage or go for the katana wielder. The katana wielder is always the most dangerous, but the, but the fireballs are always the ones that get me. They're the reason I always get like just kind of chip me down. One of the two. All right. Well, let's do the shortcut. Go this way and this way. The snake. Grab this real quick. Didn't need it. That was dumb. Moving on. All right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> you should make a channel called Shortcuts. The shortcuts locked. <laughs> no, that sounds awful. Mm -mm. <laughs> No. I have secretly been kind of plotting a like a third channel, not in relation to anything I do here. Um, just because I had a really random stupid idea that sound, that was something like, you know, that could be fun and would take like five minutes to make a video and might be just a fun like experience or uh, what do you call that when you've got uh, it's, it's a misused term now, but like a social, it's a social experiment. That's what it was. It's a social experiment. Uh, it do, it's not going to 
hurt or even affect anybody in any way so don't get that twisted but um but yeah no i just there, there might be something i try later but i, I don't want to talk about it because if it if i talk about what it would be that would ruin the experiment of like hey if i make a random new channel with just a completely different style of content and things can i do just as well on that channel as i do on this one probably not but time will tell so but like i said it would be like something that literally takes a video would take five minutes to do be very minimal effort content i'm just kind of curious but that's for a later day i don't have time for it right now though unfortunately got too many too many videos to edit too much content to make on this channel Woo. Right. I've decided what every eight person in a group fight decides is that the mage needs to go first. Always kill the mage first. All right. Yep, and now it's your turn. Mr. I have a stretchy arm. Show it off, why don't you? Oh, he really is. Okay. How do I separate you two? Excuse me? <laughs> I beg your fucking pardon. There we go. Come here. Oh, you're going to be in the corner for me? Oh, you're going to go in that corner? You want to sit in the corner? Oh, I don't want to be in this corner. Hold on a minute. All right. Let's, uh... They, they fall and reverse that on me, didn't they? Again, with the stretchy arms, both of you. Okay, there's half of it. Stay away from Flamey Boy. Okay. Hmm. Come on. Need you guys to separate just a little. Like one of you lore walk at a time, please. That would be that would be helpful. Just one. I'm in a corner. Nope, stop it. Okay. Damn it. Oh, how I hate you. How I hate you. Hmm. Katana guy has the insane region phase two. Yeah, we should probably kill him first. We should probably kill him first. That would be the way to go. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Walls don't exist in Soulsborne games. Uh, well, I think Soulsborne games disagree with you on that one there. For the player, anyway. <laughs> Not for the enemies. The enemies don't care. All right. Why kill Pyro? Uh, because he's got low amounts of health and is also pretty dangerous as far as, like, just the damage he can output. He can stun you so that everyone else can wail on you. Do these guys give health? Do you guys drop anything? I feel like no. Could use some more health pots, unfortunately. Hmm. Yeah, it's not like we're going to be able to backstab any of these guys. And parries are off the menu. Nah, we'll just keep going. We'll be fine, maybe. If not, we'll, uh... We probably have the damage to go into the... Uh, what do you call them? Into the Chalice Dungeons now, so we can... We can push our way through there if we need to. If we need to get some more stuff. <laughs> Poison run only one. Never. <laughs> Fucking never. Absolutely not. You always kite them around the big gravestone. Yeah, I think that's everyone's strategy, if I'm being honest. It's usually a good one. It's usually a good one. Yep, there. And so the chip damage begins. <laughs> Alright, you. Ooh. Nope. Just get the hell away from me. Do appreciate... Oh, the flamethrower guy. Jesus. 
I do appreciate that they um they have very little poise, so I can at least wail on them. But but when the other ones catch up, that's a problem. So bummer, dude. Mm -mm. <laughs> Will you do a challenge where you just <laughs> farm the proofs of Concord? No, not uh no. That is a that's a hard no. I did it once. I will not do it again. Fist only run when? Uh, you can just go to Zero Lenny's channel for that one, can't you? Pretty sure he's already done it. Pretty sure that's already covered. Might have to go the long and patient way. Yeah, probably. Probably. Sounds good, Solaris. No worries, man. <laughs> it is the plate of mercy if you tried letting them go peacefully. I have not. You're right. I haven't tried negotiate. Is that what my L2 does? <laughs> I should have known. One second. There we go. That's better. Alright. Yeah, I think we we need to go after the katana man. He's dangerous. He is dangerous. Honestly, any of them would be fine, really. I mean, the katanas suck the most, especially in phase two, so I wouldn't mind getting rid of him. So we, we'll go after him, but it's just going to take a bit. A lot of kiting. So it's going to take a lot of kiting. Just always. Always fun. Keep you away from the flamethrower guy. The other guy's gonna be a problem eventually. Just dodge, be all right. Keep an ear out. Don't attack him. Tempting, but don't. Flamethrower guy's just waiting right around that corner. Ow! Oh, the flamethrower! God damn it! Ah, oh. <laughs> that guy, man. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking God. Oh. All right. We'll be fine. The strategy is working. We just got to remember where he is and not get greedy. That's all. That's all. Devin, you did miss a lot. What the heck, man? No, it's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. The VOD will always be there. You can watch the VOD. How many chapters are in Armored Core? Just out of curiosity. I don't know how many far I go. How my, how, uh, that wasn't words. I don't know how far in I am. There's only five? Oh, shit. Cool. All right. Damn, I'm almost halfway. Nice. That's a pretty short game, huh? 15 for 100%. Yeah, I heard that. You have to go to New Game Plus 2, I think. I'm about to clear Chapter 2, so... I've heard Flamethrower is in Chapter 3, which I'm excited about. That's going to be a good time. There is a major point to doing New Game Plus and Plus Plus. Uh, yeah, isn't it like you get the true ending, right? If I'm remembering that correctly. I think that's the case. A Rano Freeze! Gifting five scholarships to the community. Thank you so much. We appreciate that here. Everyone enjoy your new emotes. Also unlock some new missions. Oh, okay, cool. Solid, solid. I just wish the Elden Ring DLC would come out. That way I can just finish it already. <laughs> that way I can put that game down. I've told myself that that's what I'm waiting for. 
Like that's why I'm that's why I'm holding off is because I'm not I'm not playing that game twice. <laughs> if we're gonna do it, we're gonna do everything. So, and the last thing I want is for it to be like, hey, by the way, the deal I can complete the firebomb run, and it's like, oh, the DLC added a thing that made firebombs twice as strong. It's like, fucking cool. Ooh, god, the chip. That is no longer chip. That is straight up damage. Ow. Has there been any news on that? On that releasing? I feel like there hasn't. Oh, I don't know why I picked that up. A whopping 260 souls. Go team. Ooh. Oh, God. Okay. We could get away from that flamethrower guy. That'd be super. Run away. Oh, nope. That was time. That was a time to strike. Get him. Get him. Yes. Okay. Not bad. Flamethrower guy sucks in phase two, but so does this guy. All right. Well, if you're just gonna warp in front of me, I'll, just, I'll slay you. Ooh, God. Okay. Nope. Oh, there it is. Okay. Run away! Run away! Oh, that's a corner. That's unfortunate for you. Oh, how unfortunate. Oh, no. Oh, what a shame. Alright. Well, come here, Tonitrus. What do you got? Don't you dare summon a snake. We're not playing that game today. We're not playing that game today. Uh-uh. Nope. You just... You just take your lumps and accept it. That's it, man. It's over. There you go. <laughs> okay. Whew. That wasn't bad at all. All right. Take these souls. Let's go. I'm taking my souls. I'm going home. <laughs> RNG gods have smiled on me this day. Yeah, no kidding. We got lucky there. That was luck. Oof. All right. Please, please give me more skill. <laughs> please help. I'm bad at Bloodborne. I need to level up skill. All right. Let me just sell these, uh, these 12 bullets I got here. Yeah, that's pretty good. And sell those two and these pebbles. And, oh, would you like some coins? All right. And without all that, I'll buy us. Oh, two. I'll buy two more blood vials. Go team. All right. Time for the rom com. Let's do it. Is that the right one? Yeah, that's the right one. Whew. Are we going to play Lords of the Fallen? Not until I see reviews. Not until I see reviews. Um, I think I, I mentioned it in previous ones. But uh, uh, previous streams, but uh, they originally invited me to play the game, but they weren't going to let me show any of the footage. They said, like, you can play the game and talk about it, but uh, there's something wrong with our visuals, so you can't show anything. We're going to give you all B-roll to use. And I said, no. <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> That's weird and dumb. Uh, so, yeah, no, we're going to. We're going to pass on that. Yeah. La, the reason I did... I, you should have just asked the question again instead of just typing my name over and over again. That was your mistake there, bud. Um, you think it looks good? Everything looks good at, start, at the start. Of course it does. They're giving you trailers. It's not until you get your hands on the game that you can truly believe it. And you know what? And to be fair, like the last one of the last videos I made there, the uh, Zen the Zone Zero, uh, which was uh, they asked me specifically. They said like, "Hey, can you watch these trailers and kind of give your impression of it?" And I was like, "Oh yeah, sure, why not? You know, I've done that for Salt and Sacrifice and stuff too. So sure, what the hell?" Um, audience made a good point. Uh, they that they were a lot of people were kind of like, you know, it's kind of weird to judge the merits of a game on its trailer. You know, like. Wait until you get the actual game in your hands. And they're right. They're right. So we won't be doing that again. 
in the future. From now on, it's strictly, hey, if I don't get to play the game, then we're not going to talk about the game. Yeah, I agree. Okay, all right. Well, I hit you because... <laughs> I, was, I hit you for Vendetta, but that was the wrong way. Oh, okay. I guess uh, this is happening now. <laughs> Are you getting chased by the bug? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Fucking run. Go. Okay, there we go. Quiz time. What's the capital of Brazil? Uh, Brazil! No, I don't actually know. I'm sorry. I don't actually know. I'm an American. Sao Paulo? Sao Paulo? Is that right? That could be. That sounds correct. Alright, you. Oh, no. The damage is... Uh, well, actually, no. The damage is pretty decent. What's going on here? Was I hitting his head? I must have been hitting his head. Uh-oh. 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 Rom, buddy. What happened there, guy? <laughs> oh, no. All right, these fucking spiders. Let's see. I'm curious. Two hits to kill a spider. Okay. That's good to know. All right, get in. And get out. Oh, God. Doing the belly flop. Run away. Oh, did I run away in the right direction? Shit. Ooh. Okay, we're fine. And get in, get out. Jesus, Rob. Yeah, do me like that, buddy. Ooh. Get with the flopping around immediately. Can he? Can he do that? Is that allowed? <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. How do you sign up for ZZZ anyway? The instructions on the website are confusing? Good question. Don't know. Um, I think, I mean, if you click the link below, it's supposed to get you there, but I couldn't tell you exactly. They're just going to give me the key, I think, early to play it. So, unfortunately, I'm a bit out of the loop on how to uh, go about it. Wish I could help you. All right. Will we play Liza P? I don't know. I don't know anything about it, and I haven't really bothered to look. I hate to say it, but uh, we live up to the name of the backlogs over here. Um, more often than not, I'm playing games at, at least a year past when they were released. So, yeah. Probably not going to play it for a while. Is there a strategy this challenge beyond matching R1? Um... I mean, getting good, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Are we going to do the DLC as well? I mean, yeah, I mean... Kind of weird to do an entire challenge run and then ignore the DLCs, you know? Fuck you. Whew. Stupid spiders. Does he summon... He summons more if you kill them all, doesn't he? Right. So even if I murder all the spiders, it wouldn't matter. <laughs> even if the spiders murder me, it wouldn't matter. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Womp womp. Womp womp womp. What can you do? Backlogs, that's not PG. We're not PG over here. My audience is 18 plus. Uh, this is 18 plus. There's a couple random under 18 year olds here, or probably just a couple people that said they were 18 on YouTube, which is fine. I get it. But, uh, but yeah, for the most part, we're all adults here. We can swear all we like. Gosh dang it. He summons per his health. Oh, really? Is that right? If you're weird if you're 13. Hell yeah, you're weird if you're 13. That's what being a 13-year-old's all about. You're still figuring out how the world works, man. <laughs> being a teenager was a good time. Would not do it again. Very happy with who I am as a person. 
I like being old. Ow. Don't want to use my health on this. I feel like this is a bad start, but fuck it. Give me that tail. Everyone's always about Priscilla's tail, but Rom tail, man. Rom tail's where it's at. Right, do we actually want to clear these spiders? That might be the play here. If Chad is to be believed, and the, and the spiders do not respawn except on his, like, when he warps. God damn it. That might be the play. Oh, right, I forgot about Rom. <laughs> Well, never mind. That's not gonna work. That was it. Oh, jeez. Never mind. That's out. How old am I? Old enough to party, uh, but also old enough to not want to. If that helps you. <laughs> That's why we don't kill the spiders. Yep. Duly noted. So 23? Now hold on a minute. <laughs> I may be an old soul, but I, I was still having the party here and there at 23. So 24 is when I dropped off. After 24, I was in the middle of a career and I couldn't, the partying was no longer an option. All right, Solaris, have a good one, man. Take care. See, there's all our 30-year-olds. I knew they were hiding in chat somewhere. That's the thing. The older you are, the less likely you are to chat. Because you're busy. You're doing things. You're, you're listening to the stream. You're not... Did I die in one hit? What the hell happened there? Um, you're listening to the stream while doing something. You're busy, goddammit. You don't got time. <laughs> I don't have time to chat. No. Yeah. Wow, that's a name. Potato, potato, potato. <laughs> uh, should you do a run that's just Obsidian Greatswords two-handed heavy? Uh, I hope you like Repair Powder. You're gonna need it. But it is a good, uh, it is a cool attack, though. Apparently, not fire. It's actually magic. So that's, that's good, because that means you won't get uh, stuck on any bosses that are immune to fire. Whew, all right. I'm over 30 and I sort of chat. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, it depends on what you're doing, but yeah. Don't want a party, never wanted to? Well, all right, it depends on the definition of party, right? Like, I'm not saying go balls to the wall. That was never my style either. But I did, like, go out on the weekend and, like, do a little bit of drinking and just kind of engage with friends and I was that guy in college who didn't go to the big parties because I was like oh, that's that's just dangerous I ain't touching that I gotta I, I want to be involved in law enforcement at some time I can't be doing some weird shit at a party for one night and ruin my entire career um, but I did have like all right I was in band okay and we had band parties and band parties were the shit because everyone knew who they were, you knew everyone there, so there wasn't any weirdos at the party. And everyone was safe, because it was like, we all know who we are, we're all gonna walk each other home, everything's good. It was a, it was, it was the best, Jesus Christ, it was the best uh, kind of partying experience I could have asked for. You know, still got to have fun. I can't the flopping, man. Is there any way to stop that? There's gotta be a way. Yeah, there was, it, I had fun, but it was also safe, and no one ever pressured you to do anything, so it was real good. It was the best combo that I could have asked for. Am I a cop? Not anymore. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I got my taste of that. I, that was not the right life for me. No, sir. All right, we are completely out of supplies. Let's go to the Chalice Dungeons. Did you know you can upgrade your vitality? Did you know I already did? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we actually pumped into Vitality a little bit. 
What'd you play? Everything. That's how I paid for college. That's how I paid for college. I said, look, man, what instrument do you need? I got you. And they're like, okay. Yeah, we could use that. Do I have less than 30 vitality? Well, yeah, I have less than 30. I don't have the... What do you, I'm still lemon. I just have more... I have more than five, though. So, I mean... <laughs> you know, we're already doing like 500% better than usual. All right. Let's go. If you, if you shaman blade Rom with a little spider's attack it, wouldn't you have to shaman blade the little spiders so that they would attack Rom? Isn't that how that works? Ooh, right. Immediate, immediate damage there. That's good. I like that. Kind of also took a lot of damage on my end, but you know that's price of success. Ran out of stamina. I couldn't dodge that kick. Damn it. I got excited. Alright, well, he'll be easy. <laughs> That's fine. That's not so bad. Oni, glad you could make it. Thanks for stopping by. Gotta take damage to give damage. That's the Bloodborne way. Uh, there is a rule against both things there. Chef Boy Sauce. That's a, oof, that's a name. Um... Parries would require a gun. Guns are not Blades of Mercy. And uh, the Blades of Mercy cannot be buffed. That is a mechanic of theirs. They they cannot accept any kind of paper. So. SOL on that one. Break the leg. Okay, let's be slightly less aggressive this time. Okay, no, hold on a minute. <laughs> Ooh. Is that a... Is a what? I didn't know you'd do that. I didn't think you had that in you. All right, well. Oh, come on. I was like, please. <laughs> please don't take this from me. All right. Bloodstone. Got a gem. That's a start. 2,000 souls. Worthless. Let's keep pushing. Is that gem any good? I'm not... Ooh, what's this? Oh, garbage. This one... Could be. Yeah. Yeah, that could be good. Alright. I wonder if we should focus on the arcane stuff too, though. I don't know. That might be worth looking into. How sassy can I be? Very little. I, I don't really have the sarcasm bone. Don't really have it in me. Oops, stepped on trap. Maybe someone would be kind enough to drop a blood gem? That's fine. <laughs> okay, cool. Thanks, bye. Oh, God. Good luck, Nito. Tell Tony I said hi. Is this real? Is this live? Only for a little bit longer. Not much longer. Right, let's not step on that again. Alright, there we go. Immediately doing better. Um, What's this? Garbage. Now this is the part where I'm less familiar. I'm very familiar with that first chalice dungeon. The rest kind of goes out the window. So we're not going to be able to speed run this as quickly, unfortunately. Oop, hello. You showing up at the tail end? Yeah, kind of. Unfortunately. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that looks right. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I forgot about rolling baby man. Ew. When's the stream going to end? I don't know. Don't know off the top of my head. Okay, cool. That's fine. Thank you. Thank you for the shortcut. Appreciate you. Mm -mm -mm. 
Mm, damn it. Up next go all fisticuffs. The only way I would ever do a fisticuff run in this game is if I was allowed to use the pistol unupgraded. I mean, because it's like minimal damage, right? Like you'd be doing like 10 damage to enemies the entire time. So if I'm if I'm allowed to parry, ah, damn it, I ran over that thing again. Uh, then I'd be totally for it. Didn't I? Okay, yeah. But uh, straight up, straight up, just smacking things with my hands. Nah. Nah, I'm too I'm too bad at the backstabs, unfortunately. Derek, best of luck with uh, with. Uh, I'm supposed to be Ram, I'm assuming. Hope they're treating you well. Uh, well, <laughs> they're treating me. That much we can confirm. Ooh. Oh, come on now. Oh, please. All right, there we go. One. <laughs> Thank you, Derek. Appreciate you, buddy. Where's the other two? No. No. Ow. Oh, there's the other one. Oh, there's the other one. Oh, there it goes. Okay. There, there it goes. Womp, womp. That would basically be a visceral only run. Yeah, you're right. Yep, yep, yep. Kevin farmed all 30 Concords kept. You got another like 70 hours, my man. Even with all of the item find gear you can get. Your best bet is to uh, go through the VODs I already have. There's a good like 50 plus hours there. That should keep you company. And if you run out there, the second channel is always available too. Fist of Grasha run has been discussed. It is disgusting. We will not be doing it. <laughs> That's a, a hard pass. I don't have that kind of time. Alright, let's see here. I want to get rid of the gunman. I would heal, but I don't have anything to heal with. You are not the gunman. Alright. <laughs> That's fine. You're not... Wait a minute. That was the gunman. He put away the gun? Oh. Huh. I didn't know they could do that. Alright then. Well, then never mind. I don't know... <laughs> This is weird. A parry only run? Yeah, I think that's basically what it'd be, right? That'd be fun. I think most things in this game can be parried. I always step on that. I don't know why. Most of the bosses like have a breakdown point of some kind. Usually. I don't know. It could be interesting. This guy. This guy over here. Hello. Come here. Alright. Dodge in, stab, dodge away. Dodge in, stab, run away. Nope. That is that he's he's going scissor mode. Alright, one down. Good. Who's left? Where's the other one? There you are. Plunging attack. Oh, there actually is a plunging attack in this game. All right. <laughs> Ow. All right, so he does pull out a club. I don't know how I missed that every other time I played this boss, but... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Stab. Run away. <laughs> really? Fucking magic pixel. Uh, die. Oh, you're not dead. Oh, wait. You're the other one. I'm so confused. What's happening? Please die. Okay, thank you. Ooh, anyway. Ooh, that was a good gem. Hold on. What was that? Ooh, yes, please. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. You never tried killing the brain of Mensis without dropping it? How would you even, though? You can't get within range. Do I like the Chalice Dungeons? No! <laughs> no, they're garbage. But they hide what I need. 
They hide the goodies I need, which is more gems for my stuff. All right. We'll plug that in a minute, but first... Let's see if we can... Oh, God, okay, that's fine. I died. <laughs> that's fine. Please get some blood vials. How, though? We don't have any souls. <laughs> we can't afford them. We're at that point. And I can't just parry enemies easily to get more. It's a whole thing, guys. It's a whole thing. What gems are we looking for? Literally anything. Literally anything at this point would be fine. I'll take my souls back if you're offering. Thanks. Hello. Stop with the hitting. All right, let's see. This one. Oh, this fucking... Yeah, I remember this. Okay. I remember this one. This one I always get turned around in. Uh -huh. Never gonna catch me. All right. Where is the bell person? Oh, there she is. Please tell your minions to leave. Thank you. Oh, that wasn't all of them. Okay. Stop it. Okay. Oh. For <laughs> Can't even hit that. Come on. Oh, a blood vial. Eh. <laughs> Alright, let's see. This looks promising. Just farm the vials for the giants at the Yarnum. I guess we could. You're right, we do have a lot more damage now, so we could do that. You ain't wrong. Hey, buddy. Okay, my turn. My turn. Cool, thanks. Good job, you. Take that gem. Open the door. There we go. Complete of mercy plus no healing. Yeah, essentially. Essentially. Oh, hello. <laughs> Excuse me, I thought you were part of the scenery. My bad. Thanks for the bullets. Okay. Back to the beginning. Just drop down, it's fine. Why not buy some inside items then sell them for echoes? I don't think the transfer rate is as high as you think it is. I don't think that's the solution. How do I leave? If killing the brain was technically possible, someone would have done it by now. Well, yeah, it's one of those things where it's like, because it's not on PC, no one has, like, modding abilities and, uh... Yeah, so we don't get to see cool stuff like that, unfortunately. That glowy guy was pacifist. He's also dead. So, you know, there's that. There's a treasure room here. We're going to skip it. If I do decide to need, that I need it, I'll go back later off stream. But for now, is this dog? I think this is a dog. I think this is dog. That's dog. Hello, dog. Allow me to help you. Good. Next leg. Next leg. Oh, why? Are you good, dog? That is not a good dog. Bad dog. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> ah, well. Would you ever do an only arcane run? Uh, technically, that's what we did with the Molotov run. They scale with arcane. I'm pretty sure I was at 99 by the end of that one. Cannot use the Come Chalice. No, I do not have online. I do not have PlayStation Plus or whatever the hell it's called. I had two heals. Uh, well, the thing is, I have to use those heals sparingly, so unless we're already halfway through the fight and it's looking good, I'm gonna hold on to those. Gonna hold on to those until it's strategically viable. No, uh, uh, uh. I don't 
hit him in the head, cut his legs. Oh, look at Liam. This dog. Oh, this dog. What? What hit me? <laughs> Wait, how was I still alive? Oh, whatever. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, Jimmy. How are we doing today? Well, it's been pretty rough. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> not going to lie to you. This one's been pretty rough. Do we have the Visceral Heal Rune? No. No, we do not. Maybe one day that guy will give me an item and won't fall off the ledge. One day. One day. Don't even need PS Plus for the Siege Houses? Incorrect. That is wrong, my friend. You need to have online in order to type in any kind of code. All right. Let's try again. Smash, smash, stab, whatever. Whatever's happening. Can't see. Doesn't matter. All right. One leg down. Again with the explosions. Gotta, gotta prep for that. Fuck it. Use one. Switch leg is broken. This front. Oh, Jesus, man. Jesus, man. There we go. There's broken. There's broken. There we go. Yield. Oh, God. I forgot about that again. <laughs> Did he just teleport? <laughs> Did you just fucking teleport, my dude? Oh, I thought I dodged through the explosion. <laughs> oh, womp. Womp womp. Hmm. Damn. How's the pet only run going for Minecraft? Uh, currently on hiatus, uh, just due to lack of time. Currently on hiatus, been very busy on my end. Is Dark Souls 2 worth it? Yeah, of course it is. There's a blood vial. There we go. Yeah, Dark Souls 2 is a good game. Um, a lot of people that have played the rest of the games complain about it because it's just different and they wanted more of the same. Um, and it is different and there are a couple things like anything else that, like any other game, it's like, yeah, no, I probably could have not done that and this would have been a better game. But for the most part, it's a fun game. I enjoy it anyway. But... You gotta, you gotta know what you're looking for in a game, man. That's that's what it comes down to. If it sounds like something you'd be interested in, then uh, go for it. And, uh, you know, level adaptability, you'll be fine. Right, there we go. There we go. Hold on. Okay. There we go. There we go. Just gonna do this little explosion thing again. Good. I have you now. I can just get this fourth leg. Uh oh. Uh oh. <sighs> I wanted the fourth leg and I did not get it. That is a bummer. Put 25 into adaptability, then play the game like any other Souls game. Exactly. Exactly. That's all you gotta do. It kind of sucks that you have to do that, but that game is so generous with the levels that it gives you, like with how many levels you're gonna get in that game. Um, if you're not like level 170 by the end, I will be surprised. So, you know, putting a pumping like the first 20 levels into adaptability. Not really a big deal in the long run. Adaptability only run. You could. You could. Nothing would touch you. You'd be you'd be drinking your Estus so quick. Fastest fastest cup in the West. Second leg, good. Break third leg. Duh. Greedy. I always get greedy. The game promotes greed. <laughs> I'm just trying to. You all right? I learned it from watching you. Do people even know that reference anymore? 
Probably not. Uh, what's my thoughts on Sekiro? Uh, it's a fine game. I don't like it very much because there's zero build variety. So I played it once and then beat everything and called it a day. The combat is cool. I like parrying. It's a good time. But there's no reason to play it again. <laughs> Press. Yeah, we're, it's, you know, we're getting there. It is getting better. It is getting better, Press, but I'm also just really bad at Bloodborne turns out so not helping zero blood vials in a dream that's right baby people beat this game with no hit level four yeah some people <laughs> some people man they this is their this is in their blood they just bloodborne is just their thing man i don't know some people can do it i am not some people Again with the, I, I swear I know the break point and it never happens. I thought I knew, and I guess I don't. What are you doing? Oh Jesus! <laughs> the hell is that? You have like one leg going broken? Is it this front one? There it is. Alright, took my free damage. And leave. And run away for once. Wow, that is a huge AoE. Okay, that is way bigger than I thought it was. God dang. You're suffering because you don't have you don't farm vials? I hate farming so much. Easily my least favorite mechanic in this game is that you don't it's not Estus where, you know, you just get 10, right? Yeah, I can have 25, which is cool, I guess, but I have to grind for them. And they get more expensive as the run goes on, which is kind of like, why, though? <laughs> why would you do that? <laughs> what were you thinking? Uh, yeah, farming is the antith antithesis of fun. Or antithesis? Is that how you pronounce that? I can't remember. Yeah, basically. Basically. Okay, but 25 doesn't help when I have zero. Exactly. Nope. Don't want to take that one on the chin. Alright, let's see if we can do this without getting caught in that, like, AUE blast this time. Could be fun. Could be a fun experiment. Run away. Good. I don't know why I keep locking on. I'm just going to get locked onto the wrong leg anyway. There he goes. A few extra hits. Run away. Good. Now give me the your left side. Give me your left side. There we go. Stuck in his legs. Run away. What's he doing? What the hell is he doing? Yeah, he's going for the big explosion. Okay, that's fine. I'm actually away from him this time. God, that's huge. Nope, no touchy. Sit, boo-boo, sit. Finally. Jesus. Oh, okay. And a bloodstone. We'll take it. Get me the hell out of here. Did you miss Rom? Nope. Nope. Not yet. Oh, man. Man, can't wait to fight him with a bow blade. That'll be fun. Or rather, just, just the bow. Okay, so let's jam some stuff into the weapon. Let's see what we can do here. Not fortify, no. All right, first things first. Can we do better? 98, not bad. 87 across the board. Maybe. Oh, with fire attack. Oh, fire attack up. Uh, no, that's not going to help us this time around, is it? Uh, duh, 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 duh. Oh, there it is. That'll do it. Oh, there it is. All right, now we're talking. Okay. Uh, for this guy here, we can boost the arcane attack. Woohoo. Or we'll just leave it where it's at. And this one, 109, is our jam. Okay. 
Well, it's something. Well, it's something. Sell these bullets. Buy some health. A whopping six. That'll do it. Where's my boy Rom? Where's my boy? There he is. Let's get him. Let's get him. You're a Diablo 2 fan. You don't have a say in grinding. True. True. That game is uh, designed around grinding and getting the loot. So. Have you ever played Terraria? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've played a bit of Terraria in my time. One could say. Kanehurst time? Oh, we could go Kanehurst. Kanehurst doesn't... They don't have the next blood gems, do they? Upgrade materials, I mean. Whatever the hell they're called. Shards. I don't think they do. They do? Hmm. Maybe. We'll see. Wee. Tips for Manus' second phase? Yeah, get the silver pendant. You want that. If you can get that, you'll be fine. Alright, giant space potato. Let's do this. Damage is slightly better. My health is slightly worse. Hee hee. Hee hee. Stop with the spidering. Oh, god damn it. Ugh. The swing sound is the real OP for sure. But yeah, the, the weapons themselves, eh, not a fan. Not a fan. Turns out daggers were a bad choice. <laughs> Man. All right. Back to it. Do you think I have to kill the minions? Uh, see, we've thought about that. The problem is, is that then Rom starts going hyper mode and starts launching magic at you. So you can't really do that. Um, because... You're getting hit from all sides. Doesn't really work. Whew. Yeah, they win in style points, but not much else. I would agree with that so far. I would agree with that sentiment so far. Let me try with just it being a short sword. Maybe that'll help us. I doubt it. Yay. Alright, 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 alright. Just fucking cool. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> That's fine. Hmm. <laughs> right there, Palash? No. No, no, that's silly. It's cool, but no. Actually, with that one, wouldn't you be able to both attack and parry at the same time? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. That would make my life like slightly less of a living hell. That would be nice. Yeah, that's kind of the weird thing about Dark Souls 1 bosses. You know, some people get like stuck on one where everyone else goes like, oh, that was the easiest boss ever. But then, uh, you know... Then you get stuck on something else completely else, and it's just... It's weird. It's a weird game where everyone has their own sticking points. Mm, no, that damage is bad. Fuck you, spider! Are we one hitting the spiders if I dodge? Probably. What is happening? I'm just getting hit randomly now. Oh, I hate that attack so much. Hmm. Okay. I'm starting to hit that brick wall. You can feel it. Starting to hit that wall. I think what we're going to do is we're going to give him like one or two more tries. And then I think we are good for today. I think that'll be it for today. Mm-mm-mm. Whoops. Is Bloodborne worth? Oh yeah, for sure. It's a good game. I'm doing a poor job. Uh, I'm not very good at it. 
but I still really like it. It's my favorite story, I think, of all the Soulsborne series. Pretty sure. But yeah, it's a great game if you're playing it properly. <laughs> playing it in a challenge run is pretty brutal. Because there's a lot of mechanics that are like, yeah, no, you should, uh, you should be using those mechanics. <laughs> and if you're not using those mechanics, you're in for a real bad time. There we go. All right. Give him a little... Give him a little stab, run away. Kill a spider. Oh, doesn't die in one hit. Cool. Give him a little stab, run away. Alright, well, let's start. Kill a random spider, just for a little bit of vengeance. Okay. <laughs> you okay, man? You sound tired. Uh, it's it's been a hot four hours, man. This run has not been a good ride, or a smooth ride, I should say. Oop, what are you doing? Which one's that? That's the AOE. Okay, tail up is AOE. Got it. Yeah, it's not been the smoothest ride. We're getting there though. Oh, going for belly rubs. And that's how that one goes. Okay, got it. I remember now. Run away. Okay. So far, so good. Taking our time. We got this. Taking our time. Keep that stamina high. That's an AOE. For the stab. Another AOE coming. For the stab. Go for the crazy pound. Give it to me. There we go. All right, we did it. That wasn't so bad. Whew. Ooh, shit. Okay, got it. That wasn't so bad, huh? First try, right? That's how that goes. GGEZ. All right. Hello, Ms. Lady. Take a little sippy break here. Oh my god. Ah, oh yes, the moon crying. Very good. <laughs> That's enough of that. Okay. Go to the Chalice Dungeon to fight Rom. Hard pass. <laughs> Gonna give that the old nope. You switch tabs for one moment and you've won. See? That's why you gotta have that second monitor, man. Got to go to your local pawn shop, buy yourself a $20 monitor, and stick it to the side. Just saying. Oh, uh, yeah. Forget about this. Okay. All right. Uh, that is not a... We need a, a lantern. We need a lantern. Okay. Nope. Nope. You stay back in the ground where you belong. You guys are a little hefty. Get me the hell out of here. Was the Dark Hand only run coming out? Uh, sooner than you think. Sometime this month. Maybe next weekend? I haven't quite decided yet. But, uh, sometime this month. Just depends when I have time again. Alright. Please take my souls. All right, what do we got here? 38 skill. And yet I still have a skill issue. I don't... The game is lying to me. I don't know. There we go. All right. Good, good, good. I think I'm going to stick with my original plan here. And we're going to call it. Pushing forward at this point would definitely result in just frustrating deaths and things like that. So we are going to call it here for today. Um, yeah, thank you. Appreciate you guys coming out here. Press, I promise I'm working on it, buddy. <laughs> Sometime this century for sure. Hopefully in the next few weeks. It'll be out. Hopefully. I'm trying, man. <laughs> I, I ran into some technical issues. The hard drive that I had all the footage on kind of broke. Uh, so I've had to slowly 
<laughs> I've had to slowly re-download all of your footage. <laughs> uh, so it's been a whole thing, man. It's been a whole thing. I didn't lose all the footage. No, we still have it all. Don't worry. Everything's safe. Uh, but yeah, no. The the original footage I was editing with, uh, it's gone. So I have to, <laughs> I had to re-download everything again. But anyway, uh, in any case, everyone, thank you so much for stopping by. Really appreciate you. There should be a video coming out on Tuesday. Uh, it's another one of my world famous sponsored videos. Woohoo! Uh, but some of you might be interested in it, so hopefully, hopefully that rings true for you. If not, though, uh, I'm hoping to also have another video on Saturday. We will see how that goes. It kind of depends on what life throws my way. Uh, but yeah, take care of yourselves. Be good to one another. And I'll see you all again soon. Take care.